Should be good. Yep. Okay. Uh, first of all, uh, I should thank Alex for coming all the way to show his understanding and development of the technology. As usual, we see our technology so correct that we are not afraid to share knowledge. And we are not afraid other people around the world to copy, to develop new concepts and do things. We warn what is wrong. I warn strongly when the things are wrong and it's getting done. And when the people do it because they think they can do it, foundation stays totally apart and independent from any damage to the foundation. I explained this very thoroughly. Yesterday, in the recording, what came, we asked when we announced that when you mix cancers with amino acid, it can create new germ, new viruses because of the combination of fields. And I warn you categorically, anyone who uses or contemplates to use, to develop, to manufacture needles as part of the structure of acupuncture, you are playing with people's life. And Keshe Foundation stays totally independent from this one. We told the technology, if anyone develops it categorically, because I can explain how you create diseases in people, you don't understand. And people look for their own private, uh, uh, what do you call it, profit pocket. You are responsible for people's life, especially if you're in the medical field and you do it with the warning I give. So if any new diseases or death cause, the stands responsible by you and not by the foundation. We are very categorical about this because we know there are people around the foundation who are developing or trying in China, especially Dr. Elia Kostova, to develop needles in acupuncture. I warn her, she has nothing to do with the foundation. She's categorically beyond the limits. We have warned that uh, if such a step has taken, I hope I'm wrong, but uh, uh, it's for people to understand and authorities to understand, we separate these kind of actions from the cash foundation. These kind of needles, nano-coated in any shape or form, delivers energies on the layer which body has no immunity for, a skin cancer, and different kind of cancers are inevitable. We warn and anything to intrude. And I give this categorical oh, warning to Dr. Dr. Kassova is, is beyond the limitation of the medicine while you are warned to practice and develop such a technology. And it has nothing to do with the work of the Keshe Foundation. And this can create huge damages to people who use it long term and short term. Time will tell and we stay independent from this. The same as what we warn about the use of amino acid in uh, reactors. I think I'm quite clear. Yeah? We made our point uh, very clear in this respect. Uh, so amino acids can attain and produce new microbes and diseases. So it's your responsibility not to do. It's your certainty to be aware how you do and how you develop these kind of uh, materials. Uh, today, we have touched on the structure of change. The structure of a new beginning with the help of Alex and understanding of the technology in different way. What we learned today is bringing the whole totality of the energy, matter, composite cancers together. And uh, what we've seen in how to use 
the nano layers as a different strength in conjunction with the GANs as different strength in conjunction with the matter as a different strength, which is GANs part of its structure to produce energy balance difference in plasma. Where? It's because he's used to wearing the microphone, so we just walked up to the board. <laughs> oh, it's true. Okay. I forgot it left behind me. Um, if you look at the cross section of this, you have the GANs, the nano layer, you have a tissue paper with the GANs, then you have brought a matter state with a GANS. And then what you've done, you've taken the energy. Can I have a red bone, please? You have taken energy with another nano layer on top. When you look at this cross section, this is what you have. Nano, a GANS embedded in tissue, then you introduce the aluminium, then on top of the aluminium, you introduce zinc. So what you've done, all these are matter of different strength because now the field force comes internally outwards. Because the GANS is more powerful than matter state. So what you're getting is the push of a nano into the GANS out for the matter level to be absorbed. So in this aluminum and in this zinc layer, you are reducing the energy of the plasma to matter state. So what you're actually picking up here is a fraction of the fraction of the fraction. So it means there is a, still a need for further understanding that in your development, Alex, to replace these two with a nano layer that instead of getting one kilowatt, you get 1,000 kilowatt. Because here, you're still working in a, a schizophrenia. No, you have a new, it's not a schizo. You have used different structure of the plasma. Very strong, holding to, pushing. This is exactly, if you look, is the same structure as what Armand did with a coil inside. Yeah? You understand? So you have managed to break internally outwards. What I can tell you very interesting is, if the cameraman can show us, we go to the system, we have set it up here. If you look, we have put two fans as the load, and we have put the system here. Uh, I try to go away that you can see. We have put a system this way that two fans are taking energy. We have connected the energy, what is getting consumed to this meter, and what we are putting back into the grid here. This meter was a red number one when we started it, which means we are not taking anything from the grid at all. 
this one, which is feeding to the grid, originally, two hours ago, was between zero and one kilowatt. And now is switching to one to two kilowatt. If you can come, the cameraman cannot come so close. It was zero and one. We've done a picture with a camera with what do you call it? Mobile phones. And now you see the number two in red is coming up. So we have already started uh, supplying the grid with uh, two kilowatt of the energy from zero to one. Now we are going to two. So this proves completely the correctness of the structure. Thank you very much, Alex. So at this moment, we are supplying into the building the energy which they need. Why we see such a huge rapid um, drain is because the building is using energy. And in time, you will see this will go into one kilowatt, one, two kilowatt, blah, blah, and the rest of it. So in past hour, we have fed to the grid point nearly two kilowatt of energy. And as the ambient builds up, we will see we start supplying kilowatts. So already within two hours, the concept <coughs> is proven to be correct. And it's not just me, it's two, four, six, eight, ten of us here. We have watched it. We can confirm it was zero to one. And now it's one to two. So it's building up. Hopefully by four or five o'clock we see. And it's proven the correctness. We become a supplier to the Italian grid. So less than cost of one dollar. And if a thousand Italians do this, it will become fantastic. This is what I explained to you. We have got this circuit set up by the Italian electricians. They've uh, done it yesterday. It was done especially for us to see. We have put out on the top and in on the bottom. This is the in and this is the out, you see it. And now the figure is running to, and um, we see where we're gonna get. Is there anywhere we can come close, the cameraman? Can you come close to see? No? Nothing is zooming tonight. You cannot we can zoom. zoom? We can zoom with an edge. You cannot, uh, yeah, but that digit is, uh, it's, low. it's red. We have, anyway, you gotta trust our word, it's 10 of us, we don't lie. Shall we lie out together? It is a thousand. <laughs> I can actually, I was going to say, I can actually see that it's it's between the one and the two. Is that correct? The red number on the out? Yeah. This is what we said. You become national supplier, but don't forget, we are putting energy out in AC, in the national grid, where we are consuming two electric fans. Uh, the uh, input is still stays at one. So we are not taking anything from the grid. We are not taking any energy from the uh, system in this country. We become a supplier. I would like to send my bill to the electricity board. What, Mr. Cash? Yes. Actually, all the components in the, um, in, in the, um, Pardon? the all the components in the classroom, they are taking <clears throat> energies from the the grid, um, the grid as well. So, ah. <clears throat> so the, 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 which means it's supplying free, the, the, um, they're getting free energy from, from so um, the system. All our computers working here is taking energy from the system. That's what Alex tells us. Yeah, that's, that's correct. Yeah. And so what I want to check something is uh, the power of each fan. It is a 45 watt fan. So every, every, what do you call it? That's 90 watts an hour. In 10 hours, we use one kilowatt. So 
uh, we are not there yet. The famous Canadian word, are we there yet? We are not there yet. And the strange thing is, we are still at one. Armand, can you take a picture of this, then you can do it, because the cameraman can. Yeah. Uh, yes, would you like to connect yourself into it? No, you can connect yourself to it if you want to, Marco. Pardon? What a what? what are, the water boiler. Yeah, that's what we did in the other lab. Yes, yeah, bring it. Did. This is the other lab. Bring it. Actually, even if you put it on in the other lab, it still yeah, comes on it. Same thing. All the grids. Ah, okay, depends. Yeah. Okay, you can join us here. Bring the kettle. Well, anybody would like a cup of tea? <laughs> Very easily. Oh, he wants three of them. You took a picture close up. So what we see now is actually uh, they're trying to focus on. Yes, you see the one. Okay. Can you do the same with the top one? Okay, leave that there. Now, can you do the one with the top? Okay, fling, twist it till we see it. Huh? Yeah, it's Sopra. It is Sopra. No, a bit more. No, we have a light on it. Hey, there it is. Don't move. Don't move. You see the two is coming down. Keep it there. Yeah? You see the two is coming down. It was zero and one. That's perfect. Yeah, it's the light you need to it. So now if you go back up, please, can you go up? You see, the two is coming down very rapidly. This was zero. So by the end of the day, it says kilowatt hours. We are putting in 0 0.2 kilowatt hours into the Italian national grid. It's not illegal because we are not consuming any fuel. The international law says if you are producing energy from national resources or you bring sources in, is a criminal offense. You need a license. We are not doing anything. We are using the national energy of our own heat of the body. All of us, the reactor which is running with the gas from the CO2. And the most beautiful thing with this is that if by tomorrow we go to two to three kilowatts an hour, we put 30, 50, 40 kilowatts a day into the grid. Not only we are not using, we are supplementing the government's subsidies. And on top of it, if a 1,000 or 10,000 Italians do the same, the mathematics build up very quickly. The mathematics is very simple. 10,000 Italians put in 50 watt, kilowatt a day. If 1 million Italians out of 70 million do it, that's 350 or 0.35 gigawatt of energy. But don't forget, this 1 million not only they are putting in, whatever they use is not there either. So, in fact, is much two, three times bigger. So, a country like Italy, if the national government decides to support, will be energy free. And I'll tell you something, Saudi Arabia King is planning a very big coup d'etat. One of the things I said I enjoyed <laughs> in my trip seven years ago to Iran was the dress I had from the Office of the Secretary of Ahmadinejad was that you're not here for energy. We know energy resources is going to finish. Just contemplate on the space technology. And now we see what has happened. From today, there is no need for 
a single cent. It takes about two to three months to bring into national grid to be spent on fuel, which causes what has been the CO2 global warming. If this procedure followed, not only we absorb the CO2, but at the same time, we make for the first time the possibility to produce energy without damaging environment. There is no environmental damage. There is no reason for changing the environment except putting what we need. Something you will understand very, very important is that because of the transformation in the system, this is the system running, this is your body, you will receive energies as you need. So you'll find out the members of people who live near these systems become very healthy because any deficiencies is supported but you cannot take more than what you need. So what you should see in the coming time, reduction even in the health problems. This is a huge development. I mean, we appetite, you lost, not lost your appetite, but you don't feel like eating because you have so much energy in you, you don't yeah. have need for food. Now you hear from Alex, he lives in the house with this system for eight weeks now. He says, you don't lose your appetite but you don't see a need for energy to eat because you receive what you need. This is what we said in the space. There it comes. The guru comes in with a teapot. Do, 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 do. He wants to increase as much as possible the energy consumption to see if the meter runs faster. We don't know if the fuse in this room, the, fuel, the, what they call the plugs, are connected to same phase as your power supply. So we see, be careful, we don't want a boiling reactor. There it is. His, how many times are you going to boil it, Marco? Uh, oh, you're going to keep on pushing it? Oh, you can boil the whole container. You can boil the whole container. Yeah, Be careful. Absolutely. Don't burn the university down, please. Huh? With, without it, we can't show anything. Huh? You're happy? No, oh, why not? Do we have a two kilowatt heater somewhere? Just plug it in. If you plug in a two kilowatt heater, We're doing it the wrong way. You have to plug that to the outside, not to here. We want to see if we can get consumption from this. You're taking from us free. Okay, let's boil it. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this, yeah. But this shows the energy taken from here. This is the incoming energy. We are not taking any energy coming in. So we're going to let you boil water. Leave it, leave it. Let the boil your water boil. And then we take it to a circuit outside that uh, the energy. No, 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 no. We want to see if you are taking anything from the grid. And we want to see if you are putting anything into the grid. This is the outgoing. This is how it's set up by the electrician. Yeah. So the, this one, the more you are using, the faster we are going. So it means as we increase demand internally, we increase our export. You see, now it's literally two. Can you come close? Uh, um, excuse me, Giovanni. We are actually supplying. We are supplying into the grid. Giovanni, your light here, yeah, enlighten us. We actually gone to two now. There he comes, the happy man. The Italian. There we are. You can see yes, it. If you can show it, there, <laughs> He's living away. you see the two is clearly not two. It was one a few minutes ago. Yeah, perfect. 
And if you go to input, the um, the light for the one watt an hour is actually blinking a lot faster as well. Pardon? The light. Let me unmute on this one too. Uh, well, the, no, no. the light. The light is actually blinking faster too. Here we have a three phase. Depends on which phase the light sits. If you turn the light off, maybe we can see it. The other one, the other one. No, it's no different. It's worse. It's worse. Ju, 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 ju. Yeah. Going to, the two is going to three. If you go up, can you go up, please? Can you go up? The two is moving into three. So we are putting energy into the system. And you see the inputs taking from the grid is literally staying at one watt. You see this coming down two to two, three. So, and very little is going on the other side. You have to compensate. Pardon? Pardon? No, you can't unplug, unplug because, you can't. Yeah, but because you need, um, you need you to need energize. to create a demand to, to get exactly. the pull. You need to create a demand. And so, what do you see by the time we finish? So, Pardon? If, so, if you plug in the refrigerator, it might have, uh, it, sorry, if you plug in the refrigerator, you might have uh, more of a draw then. Uh, the more draw you put into that, the, the more you're going to put out. Yeah, that's true. That's correct. Yes, in a way, yes. I mean, you can connect the, um, the laptops will go only on DC. There is a very interesting, if the input goes up to one to two, it's not actually the output goes much higher. So in fact, defeats what comes in because you put it back in at a higher end of strength. So you will see the input will go up, what we take from, but the rate of output goes much faster. So by the time we go to two, we are most probably five or six. Yeah, I see three coming up there already. Pardon? I see three is already visible. Three is already visible. You see it now? Um, we especially put, as you see, my handwriting is, as the electrician gave it to us, we wrote on it that there is no uh, confusion. It's just out. This is how it's going to be. He tuned the phasing. He's told us exactly how to connect. And he tested it. And you see, is that the one out? Three, the three is fairly visible, yeah? Can you turn the light a little bit? You see the three. And so now we are putting in about four or five times more than what we are taking. So you've seen it at zero cost, the energy control is over. You have to follow the pattern in the due course, uh, we will make a proper drawing of how to do it, the way to do it. And you will find out, if I'm correct, Alex will confirm it to us. The more pieces you add, the more power you put in. Yeah. The more cells you add, the more, the more yeah. cells you yeah. add, the more. the more power you put in. So you can increase the number of cells by increasing. You see, you're going from one to two on the input. And then, don't forget, is the water kettle stopped? Not yet. Not yet. It's still boiling because you're boiling some water plus the two fans. So you see, we're going to two. And can we go up? You see, we are going from three to four. 
And in time, in the coming hours, in the next few hours, the one is irrelevant because the ratio becomes so high that you are still a supplier. You're still supplying huge amount, double what you're taking within the first two hours. And this, pardon? The kettle has stopped. Yeah, okay. Now you see the four is coming down on the output. So we are putting. I seen as, as soon as that kettle stopped. I seen that uh, that light uh, well, that was blinking very rapidly before. It's no longer blinking as rapidly. No, because the more you put the line on, the more you supply. And so, does that does it, it doesn't even matter if it's one twenty or two forty or whatever else it is. Nothing, it will nothing. it will it will uh, condition itself to whatever's put in. Yeah. So in fact, you are, you become a supplier because you already not only supplied yourself, you put back in double the amount you supplied, you you consumed. So we've seen it. The, we showed the theory. Alex showed the practical way of making it. Now we have put it to test. At the cost of less than a dollar, you can have as much energy as you like, anytime you like, according to what you like. And I go back to, as Alex said, that I don't have to worry about heating my house this winter anymore. Because in the past, you had to select. Yeah, I have to, I have to rationalize my, my, my heating because it's expensive for me to run. I can't, I can't run it all day long when it's cold. But this winter, I'm going to put it at full blast. <laughs> <laughs> but I tell you something. This is a word of a woman, my wife. I love her so much. She said... Now we can officially use and heat up the swimming pool and the house. Because as a, as a scientist, as a developer, every time we get attacked, they will look for a energy resource sources, power supply to damage us for whatever, a nuclear material. We've seen it with the King of Belgium. Now, I can put a, actually make a decoration outside the house from this hanging and supply all my neighbors and have a warm swimming pool in the winter. This time I won't break my head like last time turned up in the hospital. So it's a big difference. And actually what this means is a warning for national governments, your income from electricity is going to be zero. Unless you find another way to tax. And then I'm sure, then what are you going to do with the fuel? Then what are you going to do with the free food? Then what are you going to do with the free application of the technology? So you see extremely interesting situation where what would be interesting, Marco, is to put again cold water in there and this time connect it to the plug next to the plug on the ground, which we are beyond our system. Yeah? We we'll see if you go. You see, we are about to go three to four. And that's all in a matter of half an hour, 20 minutes. Um, now, Marco is going to connect it. This was on our grid. And we go to the next grid. So, what is happening is mm -hmm. By increasing the demand in the circuit, is releasing more. You shrink the gravitational, so magnetical, which is what you put in grid, increases. If you look at it as a plasma, If you look at it as a plasma, this is here. 
This is exactly what Alex has done. As the magnetic hole, we, can put a, we always do one red and one different color because it's really strong. If you do the gravitational and magnetic hole, as you increase the gravitational, there is more magnetic hole available. Understand this. If you understand this, what I just said in the last two sentences, you have found the key to motion. If you understand what sits here, as you increase gravitational, as you pull more electricity in from our circuit, you release more of the energy in the circuit to be put out from the environment. So you have entered directional motion. And if you take this one step further in your reactors, I promise you, in a very short hours, you will fly. This is, nothing has changed here from day one when I said, I stood here, I stand here, I watch everything. When I said with a fat boy, this 100% flies, there was a gentleman sitting here called Marco, turned on to Armin and said, he said the same thing with the plant pot, but it's not flying. Correct? No. Yes. He said, what did he say? He said the same thing about the plant pot. No, no, no. no. What was the other one? I told him, I said, let's uh, reassemble the plant pot and reload it again. That's all I said to him. Ah, that's what I heard. He didn't I thought. say nothing. Ah, no problem. I do apologize. <laughs> I don't remember. So I remember I'm correct. <laughs> and I said, yes, you would have flown. So you've seen this as it is. And now what is interesting is, this is going to shock you in so many ways, but it needs for you to understand. If Alex, brings this circuit, if Alex brings this circuit, okay. I'm gonna go back. It's okay. Yeah? Try not to touch the metal. What? Try not to touch the metal. Try not to touch the metal. No, no, I won't touch. I've seen it yeah, before you know yesterday. See yes, I had my fright here. <laughs> okay. I, I nearly got fused <laughs> to the table yesterday. It was in my hand. I never thought. I just took the unit, this one, and I just put it on the table. <laughs> and it fused everything. Good job my finger wasn't in there. So what happened if if you take the inner this this structure and place it on top of this frame, the star formation, and then change the demand on gravity or magnetical field, I promise you within seconds you fly. Yeah, but you have to know how to do it. Because don't forget, this sits in a circle on top of the star formation free plasma. You should see, but you have to measure the correct size that your plasma fits both in gravitational and magnetical. I explained to you something which Tesla did. I showed this to Alex yesterday in the lab, and a lot of people have not understood. Professor Miles have understood it, but very cleverly has disguised it for his condition to be proven, excuse me, can you hold this? I'm losing a lot of weight. That's good. No good. <laughs> you gotta be fat to be fit. So, listen to something very interesting. 
We're going to show this in the coming days because we have a full Tesla unit here. We have an energy Tesla unit. We have a communication Tesla unit. The foundation has paid something like eight, 9,000 euro for them to Professor uh, Miles. And you've seen it in Nino. He used our unit to show the fluorescent tube. Understand how it works. And so we add to the knowledge of Tesla and we add to the knowledge of uh, Professor Mann. Professor Mann has understood it very easily. Tesla understood it fully. What you have is this. Tesla unit from Professor Mann has a board and has a silver ball. This silver ball is hooked up onto the plate with three plastic that he stands in position. And then he has connected the central, this is a silver ball, through the central, through a wire to the center of the plate in the bottom. The trick, you don't look because Professor Mile is very clever in trying to hide the understanding of Tesla because otherwise he has no credibility in his scalar wave. When you look at this plate with Professor Mile, which has interpreted the, the pattern of Tesla, on the top, this is, we have how many plates? We have eight plates, correct? We have eight plates of Professor Mile. All the plates on the top are like this. Flat coil. Flat coil rounded on a printed circuit. Yeah? And then some of another one plate is like this. Tighter coil. But the trick is what Professor Mile has done. Professor Mile uses the link of common denominator interaction of plasma. On the bottom, all the plates have circuit like this. And the diameter of the rings is equal to the diameter of the ball. You pick up the plasma because it's chosen a copper and it's ring. He transfers energy to the center plate. What is the difference between this and this? According to interaction becomes the energy available. Power supply, Transmission of information in kilohertz. Gravitational, the size of gravitational. Magnetical, the size of magnetical. Tesla transferred the knowledge totally different way, where he used this dimension by a scale to the size of the planet Earth. So, he could receive energy anywhere on this planet. And he added this as a transmission. Professor Mile has used this as gravitational. I'll bring you the plate, you see it. So in fact, the transmission ball and the diameter of the earth have a ratio. And then he created a copy base in his car and voila, now the energy is transferred any way you like to a motor or anything else. This is the secret of Tesla. This is what nobody has understood today how Tesla works. It's the first time I opened the patent of Tesla. So what it did on the receiving end, when you look at Professor Miles' plate, 
He has one plate like this, and he has a matching plate in another place. This is in Russia, the other one is in his car. He only could understand to work within the diameter of the planet Earth. Now, the way you work as a plasma, your plasma has the size and the characteristics of the plasma of the universe. So the gain is no different. But in a both ways, receiving and sending in the same plasma instead of making a plate to receive, to match, to send, to receive. Within certain uh, band, with a certain tightness, you transmit information, certain tightness, you transmit reject power. And don't forget, Tesla never could send to receive. He was always sending from one to be received by one. And Professor Mile has referred it. That's why in Faraday cage, you cannot send, but gravitational field is stronger and you can receive. This part, sending out, is what Tesla understood that did. This part is what Miles has understood and is done. Because you send out, it's a level of throwing, depends on what, how much you're allowed to throw. A box blocks you. But what, Tesla, what Professor Miles says is, because it's gravitational, it pulls in anyway. So physical barrier is no different. And then Miles trying to justify his system that is the scalar way. There is no scalar way. One is working with gravity. One is working with magnetical. Both the same strength, both the same equation. The only thing is the gravity, the pull, is always stronger than throwing away. So, in fact, Tesla in Moscow threw away and it collected in, uh, what do you call it, in New York for his car. So they got his car from him, they couldn't understand. For the first time, do you understand what Tesla did? So, but the difference now with you, this is what Alex said to me yesterday. He said, oh, now I understand. Can I have the ball? I said, the system take back and do what you like. He wants to fill in the balls with guns. Then you can hear that beacon through the universe. Because now he's confined it to a ball, but it's a ball of plasma. And now you understand in a very short time, energy production, if you've understood this with Tesla, in gigawatts from a single place is available. All you need to do, you don't need to put any more wires. The wire transmission is finished. But today, if you understood, is not the end of only production. If you understood how you collect it, now you don't need any wire to collect what you want to collect where you want to collect. Teapot, a fridge, television. Now only we need to put a printed circuit of the amount of energy we want to receive at the point of demand. In fact, all we see today is control of plasma into conversion of energy. As I said, the development has to be very rapid. Within the next few days, a lot of you should be able to produce systems which have no wires, totally wireless, and totally harmless. Because when you create the right connection, your Tesla in New York, your Tesla in anywhere in the world you want to be, you're a Tesla in the universe. Because you have made a matching here on Earth. This is what I said. You develop when you get to the point of understanding, I teach. I explore and I open the books. So now you understand. Very simple. You send the message. 
is sent as any power immediate, you rewind the message received immediate. The whole structure is done very, very perfectly by Alex, but he did not understand in a way the totality. And that's why the job of a teacher is to teach, to understand, to put things in equation in the right order. You can demand a hundred kilowatts, it'll be there instantly. The way the system receives energy, and you're seeing it now, is building up. Now, you need to find a system that receives energy at the amount you need. Now we put the kettle on, we don't need the wire. If we can print a circuit in the background, exactly like this, instead of being a collector to be a receiver, your kettle boiled with no wires. So the economical cost from today of energy transfer is zero. We've seen the solar cells, now we see plasma cells. And this should run like a wildfire throughout the world. You don't need to send a man in Africa a system to produce energy. You send a man a little circuit which works the same way, and you say, please connect it to your television. It'll be there. Because here, from the same source, you have sent the energy, but through plasma. Central power supplies, transmission lines at one to two million dollars per kilometer are buried. If you lot knew how much governments put in maintaining transmission lines is a percentage of national asset. I know the Westinghouse man knows in the background too. Transmission lines is one of the biggest burdens on the Chinese government development. And if our Chinese friends, which I know a number of them are listening, understand this, I tell you, Mr. Hoi, with his investment in transmission line in China, is out of business, unless he develops and confirms and transfers immediately. Because if you understand it, it's a very simple, actually, the receiving system is very much the same thing, reverse winding. Cost zero. The way you learn to transmit, you change the gravitational system out and the magnetical system in. That's all. Understood? So, if you reposition, now the magnetical becomes a receiver. So, anywhere in the universe, zero cost. Congratulations. Anyway. Italians, we wait. <laughs> Welcome to Africans. <laughs> we have to understand. It's very important the way you have been taught to even produce ganses and nanomaterials relies a lot on the first group of knowledge seekers, especially these two. Especially these two have put a lot to bring it in a language that everybody could understand. Making it, developing it, and you're just walking it through. 99% of you have no clue what you're doing with nanomaterial. But you watch a video, you've seen something, you've got it there, you repeat it. That's what all it needs to be. For people to do it, to see the benefit, then they understand it later on. And now, what is our reading? Let's have a look. I'm getting blind, I can't read. 
you are between three and four and one and two, but you are still loading into the system. So we are. Yes. Oh, it's just. Uh, did you want to try plugging in uh, one of those computers into that? Because that UPS will draw. Computer? We can load all the computers into it, but they're short wires. So, in any case, Marco, I think you better put your kettle on again. It's a bigger energy demand. It's 800 watts, where these are only 50 watts. Um, Oh, something jumped. Something here jumped. So let's have a look. It's three, four. Is one going to two? It's been the same position that's been the same. So, would you like to put a demand on the car and the load? Is that is that boiling on this outside? It's already boiled. Okay. Open the cap and let it boil out. It's nice. There'll be a sauna here. Thermostat. Yeah, the thermostat only works if the steam goes back on, no? Is it boiling? Yeah, let's see. Let it boil. I hope you don't mind having a steam bath. You know, a sauna is good sometimes, clears the skin and the brain. So what you see now is in, which one are you showing? Giovanni, a little bit. Are you on the bottom one or the top one? You're on the out, between three and four. So, what is important is if you understood, that's okay, we're going to read it again, it's okay. If you understood this, if you understood what was explained now, so remotely from outside, you can control the performance of your star formation legs. So what you do, if this is, sits there, and you have your star formation, now we're changing the field demand. Excuse me, can we speak? This is important, I think, more than boiling a kettle. Leave it there, it blows out. Yeah, yeah, it's okay, no problem. Get back there, this is more important than a kettle. Switch the kettle off, it gives you a piece of mind you can carry on. Leave it. Okay, sit down. Leave it. Leave it. He's a, such a tidy man, he gets excited with boiling of the water. Leave it. So, you got to understand Test Foundation is full of nice people. Look, you have now a free plasma in this position. You have a free plasma condition in the center. By changing this, you can control and change this because it's already receiving energy from it. So, you want to take off, increase it remote. You want to land, increase, decrease it remote. At least one or two people in this place. I tried to keep Alex here because he's gonna do it before all of you when he gets to England. Should be able to fly within next two, three days and be honest enough like Alex to come and teach it and put it in public. Because now you have learned how remote, at least you can control 
the left hand landing. This is what I said when the Italians came down with a big call a few weeks ago when they came to see me. I said, this system is both energy and motion system. This is the first time when you put the reactors near each other or in a position of a cell like this, you see the energy and you see through energy how you control the lift. So, irrespective of how you run it, all you need to do in the time of control is just fling the switch to this or to this, because the rest of the apparatus is exactly the same. You want to land, switch over. You want to take off, switch over. Which way would you like to go? I want to take off. Huh? I want to take off. Take off. Yeah. Very easy. You understand? So, in fact, now you have a full energy because the energy production is not going to change here anyway. Is your flight position in respect to your central core does. So, all of you who bought the Cash Foundation new star formation, if you have know how to make these little circuits, I think you should know by now, all of you should be in a flight position in the next month or two. So, tell your cousin, I'll see you in Washington tomorrow for lunch, and then we go for dinner to Tokyo. You'll do it, because you have enough time. Don't forget, we can do this on planet Earth because here we have a full GPS gravitational magnetic field released by NASA and the Russian Space Agency on a daily basis, hourly basis. So we know the gravitational magnetic field at a point in Washington. Don't promise a dinner at home tonight in wherever you come from. Pardon? Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh, no dinner tonight. And don't promise the boys I'm home tonight, Papa. Yeah? Because if you have this, you promise me you fly my Persian carpet. You remember? And yesterday I opened the boot to put his suitcase in. Says, oh, that's a flying carpet. I said, yeah, not yet. Because you don't need an aircraft, you don't need a pilot. You tune your GPS gravitational magnetic field over the house, it's unique fingerprint. You don't forget the Tesla boy, you're home within seconds. Just be careful you don't fall out of the earth, you gotta get yourself back in. Yes, now even the aviation has changed. But the beauty of it is you don't need my carpet. You can just fit in your car. He's done it. This guy, I'm going to stand off. He's going to explain to you how he runs his car. You want to talk or are you chickened out? Uh, <laughs> You're not shaking anymore? No, no, that's not that. Good. Carry on. I'm here to give you a little bit of support okay. if you need it. So, um, uh, he looks very official, huh? He's got a tailbone. He's a news <laughs> agent. We cover you. Okay. So what I've done um, with the car system is this. Uh oh, explain. No, 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 no. You're too quick. What it I'm doesn't make sense. This? Then they ask us, what did you do next? Okay. First so, of all, what did you understand? Come there. Here is, you're too dangerous. You ride too fast. There. Okay. Explain what was your concept about using the technology in the car. What did you do first? Um, I added um, the cameraman wants to sorry, see you. Sorry. I added um, CO2 to my why did you do that? Who gave you the idea to do that? You gave me the idea. <laughs> no, I know no. I gave you the idea. <laughs> <laughs> in one of the teachings of you can put CO2 in the fuel and what it does it goes and does it straight away. Yeah. The copper oxide and CO2, yeah. 
Yeah, you know. already burned the cylinder twice. You better watch. He says, I'll be in Barry in 200 kilometers away. Five days later, he's still there and I passed him a long time ago. Have you seen the road runner? So, what was the idea to put? What did CO2. you do? Because I, I, did you put CO2 or copper oxide? Uh, I think it's, I, I can't remember. I think it's CO2. And then I had copper oxide in the, in, in the reactor. But the idea was that I wanted to link the fields of the, um, the one in my tank. Link the fields the of the gans in the, the tank, tank to the reactor in the, in the car. He put a That's reactor, one reactor a star formation. Just one reactor. One reactor. Yes. Now, it's important, understand this. Excuse uh, you Italians. Excuse or shall we go like this? I don't want to do other features. I've learned all those. They tell me you haven't learned Italian to talk. I said I've learned all the back things. Body language doesn't need to speak. You learn it from the Italian on the driving on the motorway. You go slow, you, they give you all the handshakes they like. So you learn very quick. Now, stop, stop. stop. Okay. This is important. This is very, very important. He said, listen to the language. So he doesn't understand. Maybe he understood, but he just followed. He said, I wanted to link the guns in the tank with the reactor in the car. The fields. Pardon? The fields. I wanted to link the fields. Yes, the fields. Don't forget, he understood it because... He already uses the same thing in the house. To him, is a natural progress. He doesn't use the CO2 or the GANS as a fuel. He, by transferring the GANS, creates a field between the tank and the car in the reactor. This is the key. CO2 is not the fuel. CO2 is a condition very much what is put in this tank. If you remember, we have shown the pictures. When the Belgium authorities came to uh, stop us to demonstrate flying car on 25th of November 2011, I showed them, I took them to the car, and the fuel tank was in the back of the car. I said, What's your? I, said I don't need a fuel tank. But it's still in the fuel tank estate. Understand what's the difference? When he puts the GANs in the fuel tank, now all the fuels within the environment of the GANs are in a GANs state. Energy release is different. Behavior of the fuel is different. You get injection motors, you get all sorts of things to make the plasma of a gas efficient enough to lose very little. He already converts some of the fuel into open plasma, so he doesn't need one when he hits the core in the cylinder has done the job. But he has something else to tell you, and then I explain. Tell us the next step. Uh, how to connect it all? Yeah, yeah. Tell me you put a fuel okay. in the tank. Yeah, and then um, I connected um, I connected the um, the reactor. I put a series of these cells on the reactor and hooked it up on my the cigarette lighter. You know the cigarette. Um, oh yeah. I hooked it up in, and then I kept it in one side of the, um, the car and let it run. I observed that when I drive. When I drive, sometimes if I'm like, let me make something clear. I have a very old car. You know, I'm a poor man, so I can I can take risks with the car. He was a very poor man till he got here. Now he's a very rich. Man. <laughs> All right, knowledge and soul. All right. So I observe when I drive, the car first is lighter, and then when I negotiate the um, a turn, it's like the car is on its own. It's just don't feel it. it. Just just goes goes like that. So like it wants to, it's, it's, I, I don't know how to explain it. It's like 
like you're driving on air. I'm not saying the car has levitated, but you can feel that it's, um, you don't really need um, a lot of um, forces. Would you say that it's like it's on rails instead, as in uh, it's a hydraulic exactly, system? Exactly, it's like on magnetic rails, but it's not exactly okay. Thank you. Okay, yeah, it's something Don't like that. Don't forget again. I'll, I'll explain. So let's draw this to add to the knowledge in a different way. He has a car, very old. We would presume it looks like this. And then he has a fuel tank. This is him sitting here, and he's made one of these guys here. And he connects this into the cigarette lighter. Am I correct? Excuse yeah. me. Are you teaching or playing? No, no, I'm not playing. I'm just trying to try something else. There'll be no pay, huh? Get here. No, no, no. All right. So teacher has to be good. Okay, okay. So when you good. when you play, children play. No, then I was just teaching. really doing something else. Ah. So you put the guns in the, in tank. the tank. Yeah. Okay. Children. This is the guns in there. Yeah. Copper oxide, CO two. CO two. Yeah. And you made one of these principal batteries here. Yeah, I made yeah? one. Yeah. So this one here, yeah? Mm. And what else did you do? You connected it into the cigarette light. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But hooks to the reactor. What I did is you connected let me, the wait, let me, let me show lighter you. to Something the like reactor. That. So what I did is I cut the wire into two, and then this is the supply coming. I use the supply to power the, the socket the same way I do with the yeah. here. Yeah, and then I just use the um, the load. I put the reactor on the load, and then I put it on the on the cigarette uh, ashtray. Yeah, yeah on ashtray. The, on the cigarette, the cigarette lighter. lighter. Yeah. So that. let's explain. People can feed their car tonight. You okay. got a, one of these cell cells. Yeah. You connected it to the wire. Yeah. And uh, which way did you connect it? Positive uh, or negative to the wire? Um, positive to the just the same way it is here. Just exactly the same way it is here. Same as here. Yeah, same as so here. So it you, is negative to the negative and the positive to the positive. Which means positive. this wire. Yeah. Okay, this is the one coming from the battery of the car. Yeah. Okay. So battery this, of the car or yeah, the, the source is the battery, isn't it? The cigarette, cigarette light. Yeah, but that's the okay, the cigarette. Yeah. Okay. So this is the one coming from there. So the negative goes here, and then the positive goes here, and okay. then the load, which is the reactors. Are coming from here and here, uh -huh. and, that, and then you put this one. Um, yeah, that's, that's it. And then that's, that's it. And then you put it on. Okay. Put, um, so put you on. connect the negative yeah. to the negative, positive to positive. Yeah. Yeah. And then, and then the load. This is the load that goes to the reactor itself. To the to the reactor, the ping pong ball reactor. You connect your ping pong ball reactor. Today. To here, okay. Yeah. Now we understand. The guy has got a ping pong ball reactor in the car too. So he's repeating the same operation. Yeah, that's what I said. No, no. Yeah. You are. You I said. said I a reactor. You said. You said to me a reactor is everything is a reactor. But okay. let me clear. Okay. So I didn't understand. now he connects to a system. And then he says, the system is very soft. I have a very old car, and it goes like this. So what is actually done through the demand creates lift in his car. Have you secured the reactor, or is it loose in the car? It's loose, but you can see it. Lift. Yeah, it's always trying to... Do you understand what is happening? This is what I explained to you here. Now, mm -hmm. so he's he's demanding from the reactors, which is causing the magnetic or the gravitational field uh, to. Bend. And his fuel tank is the gun sitting in a tank. Now you understand. We'll explain in a short while. You understand. So I'm going to ask you something. Mm -hmm. I'm the driver. Mm -hmm. Where is the where is the chain? Where is the, the reactor? Link? Is just 
beside me. Beside you, on the driver's side. No, he's an English man. So oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> you don't know the confusion. <laughs> I used to drive in Europe and live in England. It was very difficult. The car would move to change. Yeah. So he, this is. I'm yeah, the, driver. the driver, and then the reactor sits yeah. just right underneath the thing. And me, or no. a passenger. You are the driver, and then the, the reactor the is passenger on the passenger. Side. Yeah, yeah. What about the dog if it jumps in? I don't have a dog. Okay, now we <laughs> have. So you, where did you put the chain? Where is the chain? It, the chain is connected. That's why I said. Yeah, I, but I where is it? Where do you put it in the car? I, I, I just hung it on the pigeonhole. Hanging on the pigeonhole. You have a pigeon in the car. Yeah, no, the pigeonhole, the one where you keep your. They keep your little envelopes and so on. Ah, the kind of okay, the pigeonhole, yeah. the letterbox. Okay. okay, you hang it in the letterbox. Yeah. Why don't you hang it from the mirror? Uh, from the mirror. Ah, oh, from not, the mirror. It's not the, the, the thing is not long enough. Long, ah, it's okay. not long enough. What about if you hang it from the mirror like everybody does, you know? But no, they but don't not, know the not, thing is like a tasky, but it's not. It's just energy. But it's not long enough. Okay, so you hang it on there. Mm. You connect it to the cigarette box. Yeah. I, I also have a question. Yeah. Pardon? I, I have a question. Um, no, no, you can't ask questions. Uh, wait. I can ask a question wait, anyway. No, you can't. You don't even ask questions. Wait. <laughs> we don't know where the reactor is yet. Yes, what but happened? I, I want to know how many of the of the base reactors so that, are on that 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 ring. Only one reactor. One. Only one. Only one call. Only one. Only one call. I'm ping pong okay. ball. Okay. Right. Now I'll tell you another secret. Wait one second. So you have this um, what we call like. This is what the Arabs call a tasbih. You know, they play with it. What do you call it? The beads. The beads, yeah? From now on, we call it energy beads. It's easier. Everybody okay. understands. Okay. You got your energy beads hanging there. You got your Think CO2 box. Reactor. What do you call it? Reactor there. Mm -hmm. your, CO2, your reactor is connected to here. Yeah. Your energy supply is there. Do you know what you're doing? No. You are using your starter motor as a running motor. In fact, you can throw away your uh, engine. Now you just told me. So maybe I'll throw my engine away when I get yeah. home. But the difference is that in doing that, because the system is in the corner, on the floor, he feels easy to drive. So. In fact, between the back and the front of the car, you created a levitation field. But it's very soft. The good thing will be, next time when you go back to England, mm. if they allow you in now, well, you know you're on the television. <laughs> when you go through Heathrow, all the cameras will be on. No, no, the genius no. of the no century way, is here. No way, no way. So, What's going to happen? You don't know England. No, I'm going to sneak in. Don't worry. I'm going to sneak in. Somebody, somebody pays the Sun magazine. You'll be all over the floor. Just make sure you got your top on. You won't be on the page three. <laughs> so what's going to happen? When you go to England next time, take everything out of the car, go on a scale, get the car weighed, see how much it weighs. In Barnet, where you live, there's one nearby. There's a weigh bridge. Yeah, no, 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 yeah, no, no, he no. actually, I have to tell you how I know this, this. That's how I actually got to know this guy about a year ago, two years ago. Mm. He wrote, Mr. Cash, I, go to, I work in Barnet. I know you used to go to Barnet College. So I had to answer him because that's the first place I went to England. So I know the place roughly. So there is a way bridge as you go to go to N25. Yeah. Yeah, mm. You take your system out. Mm -hmm. You go to Waybridge. You weigh yourself. You go home. Put everything back in and go and weigh yourself again. See if you okay. still weigh the same. Okay, but do I have to let the reactor run, the, the plasma build up a little bit, or I can whatever you do, whenever you're happy, mm. do one without and do one with it. See if okay. you weigh any different. Okay. So it's very good. Barnet is one of the most most beautiful part of London. Years ago, I don't know about now. Yeah, it's still nice. It's still, it's still nice. It's, still nice. it's got a very Sharp hill, and the college is right on the top. You want to go to school from I'm very there, green, I'm very green uh, as well. And yeah. you want to go up from the train station, metro to up, it's a good walk. And sometimes you get tired, there's a court on the left hand side. You go and rest in the court and listen to court sessions. I've done that a few times, mm -hmm. correct? Yeah, on the left hand side. So now, what happens? 
he has created a condition where now by plugging into the cigarette ashtray, he is using the generator, the starter motor, because it's got enough power to push the, what do you call it, the camshaft to start the car. He's actually supplying his the starter motor as a runner. So the starter motor is feeding it. He has a small story to tell you, then you know what it is. What was the measurement of your battery before? Um, I think about 11 point something volts. And what was after? 18 point something volts. So he is charging his battery and he's feeding his starter motor. 18 volts? That's, that's 18 volts. More, more than 18 volts. I hope that it didn't explode here shortly, but I, th no, I know no, that's more no, of a no, plasma volt. Right? No, it's a plasma state. You'll never yeah. do. No, but yeah. this, thing, this thing, I wasn't measuring the, from the battery. I was measuring the cells. I was measuring, measuring the, cells. the cells. This cells, I was measuring the cells, not oh. the battery cells. Oh, was, oh, you're measuring the cells, so you get 18 yeah. volts. You understand that. So now you understand very simply, he's used the same knowledge, the same technology, and I tell you, we told you before, you might want to hear it again. He usually, don't forget, he's a very, very old man, this gentleman, extremely old. He was black hair when he came in this morning. He's got gray hair. We just noticed with Alman before he comes in. <laughs> Maybe he talked with Alman a bit too long. <laughs> He's a creature of habit. He lives very near to where he works. And he's done this for 20 years? About, so. About 20 years. And how much fuel do you use? How, how do you buy fuel? Um, I just put a quarter every, every now and then because I live very quarter close of to... a tank or yeah. half a tank. No, quarter of a tank. Quarter of a tank you put every how many weeks? Every month. Every month. So he uses quarter of a tank because the shop is near the house. Yeah. Now, when did you fill the tank the last time? Um, so that's every month about quarter mm -hmm. of a tank you buy. About April. So you loaded April. in April. Do you know when April beginning end? End of April. End of April, mm. and you still do the same thing as a creature of habit. Yeah. Have you filled out the the tank yet? No, since then, no. Uh, you still, I still have, I still have, just under a quarter, just under a quarter. Just under a quarter. So you've driven the whole of, let's say, May, June, and June. We are July yeah. today. It doesn't count. Yeah. So in this time, how much fuel? You still got a less than quarter. Yeah, I still get. Just, no. Just, just a little yeah, bit less than four. Yeah. So, in fact, he hardly used any fuel in two months. So, BP shares take a nose dive. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. In a simple way, a single reactor, not a star formation. Those of you who is buying, who are buying a large number of single reactor cores from the foundation in past 24 hours, because it's gone on sale. Somebody's bought 60 of them, I think. Somebody has reactors. bought 60 reactors, single reactors or 60. Yeah, I think they bought 60 reactors. Or... No, no, just a single, because we sell a single reactor. I think so, I don't know. I was told a figure by somebody. I think, how much was it? I think it's um, Vince. Mr. Kit, I'm going to miss it. Actually, it was in March. Was March. Okay. March, Sorry. We go back. The story March. is worse for BP. Yeah, it end of <laughs> it's March. So and it, it was March. 10 reactors at a time, by the way. Pardon? It was 10 reactors at a time. 10 reactors. No, somebody has bought 60 health uh, pain pads. That's what it is, the 60. So, uh, but they, they made a mistake. They only paid 25 euro. So, it's no one, I would have bought 60 of them at that price. So, March, end of March, so you had the whole of April, mm -hmm. May, and June, and literally no fuel is used. So, what I extra recommend to you tonight, get your CO2s. It's not my problem, it's yours if you like to do it. How much did you put? How much CO2 did you Just put in there? A syringe. 
Yeah, so it's not a big syringe. I think it's a 15 or 20 mil syringe. 20 mil of CO2? Yeah. Has she become the tea lady? Yeah, you're betting the grand Marco. Oh, no, full, full. No problem. So he hasn't put a lot of guns into the tank. He's only put 15 mil syringe. Yeah. Our syringes are 50 mil. You're talking about one five milliliter of CO2 exactly. in a tank. Mm -hmm. uh, what I call a bead set. It's very little, it's about this much. And then a reactor in the car. Connected reactor to, okay. Cells. The bid, the bid cell is connected to negative and positive. Yeah. And the core is connected to negative no, and negative. Positive. No. What but is your core? This is the core. Yeah. This connect, that's the load. This is the load. So, so it's connected to this one. Connected so the, 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 to yeah. positive and, and negative. negative. And then the um, the, uh, the, the cigarette. Motor. Yeah, it's connected here. To the cigarette box. Connected to cigarette box here. Yeah. I should write it this way. Cigarette box here. Yeah? Mm. So you connected that positive to negative to the cigarette box, the beat. Mm -hmm. And you connected the core positive negative as a load. As a reactor, load. For the reactor. So understand his terminology. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. Can we have a bit of a thing? He sees the core as the load. He sees the bead as a supply. Yeah? So it's the other way around. No, that's what he says. No, it, this, I'll take it. I don't. I didn't quite follow it. This is this is this leads to the cigarette um, cigarette box. Cigarette box. Yeah. And then this leads to the load. That's the load. The the core. Okay. The load contains the cells and the reactor at the same time. Ah, okay. Yeah. The so so it's a continuous. That goes, it's a, it's a continuous. To, that goes to there. The supply, mm. so the load and the bead, yeah, yeah, it goes, yeah, it goes to the uh, what do you call it to the ashtray, yeah, yeah, to, to the ashtray because that's that's the, that's the power supply, ashtray, okay, ashtray, uh, no, I mean, ashtray. the cigarette, um, the cigarette okay. lighter, the cigarette light. So where are we? We are a bit confused. Yeah, no, I'm not confused anymore because this is the load and then this is. This is the supply. This is the supply. Which supply is this. goes to cigarette box. Yeah. So and then the load, the reactor goes to the load. The reactor, okay, I'll explain it to you this explain way. Explain it. I'm a very, if I've I never learned about electronics and electrical. I was I the know, worst guy. Yeah, I don't know nothing about electronics as well. But if this is the. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Amon. See? Now, this one, the negative, um, the positive. Yeah. That's what I connect. The positive goes to the the um, secret lighter, secret, secret. and then the load from here and here goes to the reactor. Uh -huh. That's all. And then so that's all. You connect yeah. the positive to, to the positive, and that's then the negative. negative here. Yeah, this is negative, and then this is positive. So, so if you put it like that, negative goes here, positive goes here. So this one goes to the. To so the you connect box. one line to the negative, one line to, to the, the positive. positive. Yeah, goes to cigarette box, and then so. Here you use one line from here and one line from here to cigarette box. No, not from here. This is the negative. I'm using the positive to. Oh, what is it? No. Yeah, this is what you're showing me no. there. From here, this is the positive that goes ah, to. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So okay. this is the negative. You see, we answer people, and then they say it works. It has to be. So you go from one negative and one positive to so cigarette box, box. Yeah. and then. The load is here. Yeah. Goes to the you go one from here. That's, that's positive. And, and one from here. Negative. To the core. Yeah, to the core. Okay. Now we understand.
So the when you made this basic supply power, the one which has the, this is the base usually where we connect the positive and negative together. No, the, the one the positive is the one that takes this. No, no, no. From okay, we take the positive. Okay. Yeah. This is the positive and negative you connect to supply. Okay. And you connect this and this to the load, to the core. Yeah, and this one starts with a positive and then this is a negative. Negative, okay. Yeah. So we understood this from this morning. That Could we have one of these fans blowing this way? It's too hot in here. It's getting very hot. Maybe it's the excitement of the old age. <laughs> Think it's both. <laughs> Call yourself old. I'm still young. Um, <laughs> you don't know. To, you don't want to know my age. I'm still young. At least in heart. All right. Um, so. Huh? Sorry. No, we can't Sorry. take it because it's putting load up. Uh, so we see this, and now in such a combination with the fuel in the car. The reactor on the floor, you reduce the consumption, of the the consumption to more or less zero Maybe. in three months. I'll tell you something. Not only BP won't like this one, nor would British government. Bed and breakfast will not be happy at all. Because you know, the British system is called bed and breakfast. They didn't know that. B and B. British government lives on the back of BP. That's what they do. You didn't know that. Of course. BP, yes. British Petroleum is the backbone of British government's work. And with such a system, they cannot exist. Don't forget. All the acquisition, all the oil operation, all the income of British government, all the revolutions have done through the oil industry, through BP. You might not know that, but you know now. All financing of revolutions around the world through the American government and British government is done through BP. Yes. Okay. Not many people know because it's a financier. So this way, they're bankrupt. The government doesn't receive taxes because nobody buys oil. And the BP cannot sell because nobody buys oil. It is applicable to all nations. You pay one euro 40 for a liter of fuel, total cost to the oil industry is about 20 cents. Transportation cost and retail brings it to about 40, 45 cents. 90 cents to about 85, different, different nations around Europe. About 90 cents is taxation for the government. This pays for your hospitals, this pays for all the military defense, all the killing machines are financed this way. Don't forget the main income of oil taxation in most of the countries supports military. If you go on the balance sheet of most of the nation and find out actual true cost of the military is equal to income from the petroleum industry where the people pay. So this way, we have taken and we can take the leg of the defense industry because they have no more money. You find out when the nations don't have money, the first thing they cut is defense. Pardon? Social services. Social services come last because they have to pay the army man. So you see how a simple man is helping towards a world peace treaty and a world map, peace map. This is how it sits. So now this morning, 
A simple man has dismantled the energy. The same man in the afternoon dismantles the oil industry. You're already in trouble. <laughs> you should have never taken the flight. <laughs> the thing is, I've done the same thing for years. Now, there is, I was told, hundreds of thousands of people within the next few hours and weeks will watch this. They're replicated. And because it works, they tell the others. So you have become partner in crime. At least it's two of us now. <laughs> Huh? You made the life much harder for Mr. Hans Brackenier now. Now he's got to plan more. So you see, excuse me, the Italians. April, May, June, he's still got his fuel in the tank. And you have not produced new fuel. You haven't produced new consumption fuel. All you've done, you have created energy which you're supplying into your starter motor and the starter motor is doing most of the work most probably we did a research with the Ghent university in producing new cars because if you know or not we were offered the general motor factory for producing cars in antwerp when general motor was going bankrupt years ago and they closed the plant it was offered to us by magna and in that process, we had friends in Ghent University, the professors in electronics, electrical. And I went to them and said, we are getting the plan. We want to become, to produce electric cars because we don't need anything else but electric in, in the general plant answer. And if you read the business plan we gave to Magna and we gave to the German government and we gave for General Motor to give us the plan, it was all agreed. One of the professors of the Ghent University wanted to be a director in this new company, car manufacturing, which can fly. And the business plan, we, we, we've seen it. I can release it to you. You know who he is. He's the second man in command of the, what I call the electrical departments of the Ghent University. He was told he cannot operate with us anymore. Otherwise, he loses his seats as a professor. So it came to an end with it. But... In that time of research, we found out the minimum weight of the car is 200 kilogram before the wind crosswind takes you and other things affect your parameter of the running of the car. So you need to have a car to weigh at least 200 kilogram to have a safe driving car. So what happens, you can create a condition of lift don't forget, he's in England. Is your car front drive or back wheel drive? Yeah, it's automatic. Pardon? Automatic. Automatic. Or the front wheel or back wheel axle? Back wheel. I don't even know. You don't know. What's this? It's a, it's a Honda. Doesn't make any. I don't know yeah, what so car it's. I just know the size. I don't know if it's front or back. Wheel. Then it would be a front wheel drive. Pardon? If it's a Honda, it would most chances be a front wheel drive. It's a front wheel drive. Okay. So you create a lift at the front. You reduce the weight at the front. That's why your steering is lighter. You have created a very complex but very system uh, weight reduction system. That's why you feel the wheel feels when you drive it different than before. Take everything out and drive and put things back on drive and you tell us. Because does, does the pardon? wind resistance go away too or lessen? Pardon? Does the wind resistance uh, lessen? Do you has the wind resistance lessened? When your windows are down, do you does it when seem like there's less wind? It, does it go faster or it goes slower? Oh, it goes faster. It goes faster. Has the wind has changed? The wind. Yeah, the wind yeah, the resistance. Like the, the wind in the window, right. as in when you have the window yeah, down. I have to find I can't. I, I, um, we can't see. He's I a very straightforward man. He doesn't know to tell you. Okay, I'll tell you shortly. <laughs> and now, get in the car and let it run down the hill. And then next time, get in the car and don't run the hill. You'll find out very quickly. All right. So now you see how simply you change the composition.
we see same development, same understanding, and we see the same kind of changes. So it is very easy for him to explain what is done. Somebody says it's impossible, but now we see with energy production, it's proven to be correct. We see it monitoring it. How much is our energy set? Good or bad? Have we lost or have we gained? We are on a full four and we're still between one and two. So uh, one and a half to four is our gain by two and a half watt putting in. No, it's clear four. We have a look at it. So um, we see the proposition. We see the change. And if you like tonight, make yourself some CO2 and add it to your, do not use. I Make sure you watch the CO2 properly, watch the salt of the CO2, otherwise you're gonna mash up your- Yeah, candy. you have to wash the CO2 out of salt when you make the guns. And please do not use, till you know what you're doing, any other mixture. Any what? Other mixture. Okay. If you do, let us know, and I'll tell you if it's yeah, good or bad. Excuse me. I've used them. Um, I've used the mixture of. Did, now I've not. I didn't um, include the um, reactor in the configuration. No, but no, I've no. But in the before, fuel, yeah, in the yes, fuel. I've used the reactor and um, um, CO two and copper oxide in my in my fuel tank. I had a half tank, and I drove for like half an hour. The tank was empty. So don't do it. That's it. That's what I'm just about I was about to tell you. Yeah. CO2, sorry, the copper oxide has a reverse effect in anything which is carbon or hydrogen connected. Do not use it in the conditions of application like with consumption, like with burning. It's very much one of the best materials for extraction of oxygen, and it uses different way of composition. So that's just about I was going to say, use the CO2 because you create a specific condition that allows it to happen. On the other hand, so in a very easy way, you can change your fuel cost tonight for the house and your fuel costs for driving and locomotive. And if you understood the change on this proportion, and you can change the system on your reactors, position the reactor in the center of the car. Very important, in the center of the car. Make sure it's securely locked. Not with a seat belt. and run your system. I'll see you in New York, or Washington, or Moscow. With putting CO2 in the right way and copper oxide, you have locked yourself into the earth. What's strong Norman? You're deep in thought. He's thinking, can I go to Los Angeles tonight? You lock yourself to Earth gravitational magnetic field because it's of the same. If you can create a composite, which is the Earth gravitational magnetic field Earth, you never fall out. You always stay within the power of gravitational magnetic field of the planet. 
But that also so, includes the moon. No, 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 no way. No, moon has got nothing to do with Earth. It's another blow of material which happened to be in the same near vicinity. Uh, so, what you've seen, uh, very simple. I don't think anything as simple as this has ever changed the destiny of man. If you look at it, it goes again and again in different directions. Make it in and out, you levitate further, you lift higher, make it out and in, you like wherever you want to go or land. If you understand it fully, you can make drilling machine, and if you can change, excuse me, yeah, I prefer not to break. And what will be interesting for you lot to understand is that he's going to do it. I know what he listens to it now. If you change the composition of your wire instead of copper, aluminum or whatever, and you change the composition of what he put in there as mixture, you create totally different power supply. It's okay. There's something I've not tried, <clears throat> I just realized. What about if we use, if we power this, if we power the cell from here, if we power it from the, other, the opposite side? Doesn't matter. It's still gonna be the same thing? More or less, depends how the energy decides to flow. Okay, because you so know, the, this, this side is, is um, sec close circuit is um, connected, the, the positive is connected to the neg negative. So if you, if you add a current, I'm wondering if it's still going to To this one? Yeah. Try it. Because what we are talking about is how you can change the power supply, energy supply. He used, for example, CO, CHO3. I'll tell you something. I knew he is correct. And from my understanding, he was in the right path. Only when he explained that he added caustic and sugar. Sugar, some of you might not know, creates a very dynamic condition. In some of the rocket launches, they use sugar. In the rockets, when they want to make a lot of noise to create a fear, they use sugar. Don't ask me how I know, but I can tell you this much. It's a military secret. If you want to send a missile to create a psychological fright before attack, before landing, you add certain amount of sugar to your fuel. Because the energy release is psychological. If you understand this, go back in how he mixed even CH3, you will find out if you understand the process and what I explained, and you mix copper oxide with CH3, the same structure is one of the most powerful medicine systems you can carry for yourself. Thank you. Oxide, CH3, and CO2. You touch the physicality, and you touch the emotion, and you touch the energy. You're dealing with the plasma. You're dealing with the Gans state of matter. So, what the extension to the knowledge is, this simple parameter as is connected to the energy of the reactor or star formation, don't forget the star formation creates a free plasma which touches the emotion and the soul of the man.
We, 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 I have taught you enough for past few weeks to understand. So now, if you, he puts copper oxide and CO2 and CO2 on its own, the same combination, you see the effect, change the car with the body of the man. This is, you want to create happiness, you want to create fear. The key, one of the keys, this is actually a very crude way, but if you understood this, you can do the same thing with your star formations, the way you load it up, the way you connect your loads. And then you find out, psychologically, you can control a lot of things in the school. You create the plasma of the matter at CH3. You're exhausted. You don't feel like working. You are tired. You need sugar. CH3. You transfer the energy of the CH3, not the material of the CH3. Our Chinese colleagues showed us with the water, with amino acid, CO2, CH3, and copper oxide and with a watermelon. As I said, we fulfilled all the promise of the past prophets. I give you water to taste of wine, and some of you have already tried it. Water, you put a wine, the right amino acid combination will taste, feel exactly as you're drinking wine. So now you can do the same thing in a different way, if you extend your knowledge with this. So, in a space, you have this preset to test wine, preset to produce beef paste. So, this is another control way, in a very simple way that a lot of people can understand that we can go at least one step further in the knowledge of man in plasma technology. So you decide how you wind this basic system. You decide how many of them you put on the bead. Then you decide the strength of the energy you receive. Four for wheat. Six for fish, eight for red meat and white meat and the rest. Because you want to gain gravitational field. And then you understand what we discussed in the teaching few days ago, why the trees don't have a toilet next to them and they don't put anything outside. Why the man and the animals who eat and use nitrogen have an excrement, we have it in toilets, where the trees don't. You transfer energy because they do not eat, they absorb the energy or reject the energy. Now you decide what you need in what the strength, you don't need to consume food, you don't need to carry food. But you can carry the texture of the food the way you want because in a plasmatic condition, it gives you the feeling and the emotion of eating meat, the comfort of meat in your brain. So you don't need to eat an animal. You still have the feeling of a beef, a real well done. You pre-program it in your packing. This is your new food system. Very hard, huh? Not to chew in the space. You understand? So, in a very simple way, because every structure here starts life with a GANS. So, in the coming days, as I said to you, we'll have people which achieve flight. We know a number of people have done, and as you've seen, how we watch things happening, I was aware of the intimidation which Alex received. He did not come online. We take different action. 
We took our time. And then we bring with such a force to devastate those who hack the email. There are a bunch of hackers, they're not government. So these are third rock in Germany. We know all their details, who they are. They're sitting on his computer monitoring. Even his ticket booking was blocked that he can't get his flight by the hackers. If you are afraid of the chickens, play chicken game. If you are a man, join the team. We support you the way we've done with Alex. We brought him in securely, very quiet. Nobody knows. He understood the position, but to share the knowledge was more important than the personal stupid email by a bunch of Germans in Austria and Germany. We know who you are. We answer you in time. I hope you enjoy a very good drink on Mars on your own, but you should listen to the technology to know how to make it for yourself. So you understand what is entailed. There are a number of scientists like him. I don't call professors and doctor scientists. These are plasma scientists. We've got two of them with the pleasure in this room, three of them. And they have understood, and they are going into the next step of flight and food production. Tomorrow, Alex will explain the food because we need to open that door. We need to bring for you to understand the next step in the structure of the flight system. In a way, every single one of you should know as much as he knows that if you are the last man in the space standing, you can even create a replication of yourself that there will be two of you that you make that the human race will survive in the space. You think it's funny? It's happened to many races in the past. The strongest survives. And in so many ways, a very, very simple system has led to change of the course in a simple way. And I like this system because it's an intermediate system between the next generation of plasma technologies and the people who are interested still to be involved in a matter of state. The next generation, and I'm sure Alex is one of them, he's going there, but he doesn't see it. Our one is not far behind in a different way, is these will be replaced with a positioning combination of reactors. You go into total plasma, but it's part of the maturity of the man who's got to go through the process. To go suddenly to plasma, you leave too many people behind. This way, we carry more people with us to be able to achieve the transition. No knowledge has been taught so fast and understood so fast by any generation of human being. So what it is, we have touched the energy. Please disperse this tube, YouTube recording of this morning and this afternoon to as many people as you can. Send it to the president, send it to the God knows whoever, and let people help themselves, and then they help the others. And in that process, we manage to take at least one leg out of the war system. And I'll tell you one thing. Again, scientists, what are called true scientists in Africa, will be in the door of the White House in no time. And the same in China, and the same in all the capitals. Because now, in the coming days, the way you see free energy, which has been the dream of the man, and they call us charlatans, we have had access to this knowledge for a long time. It will be the time soon that there is no borders. This man, in a simple way, in his kitchen, has produced one of the most advanced science technologies man ever known. So now 
we come to the people who jump on for the next step and it will be travel. You learn how you can put the bead on top of a reactor, control its plasma. If you understood what I explained about Tesla, I don't know from what I see on the internet, two, 3,000 people should be very soon on their way. And if they are brave enough to come and show it here, we'll have the whole world moving across without paying $5,000 for air ticket. I've paid that a lot of time. I never understood why do I have to pay 5,000 euro for an air ticket. And then they give you one ticket free. So why don't you give me a two and a half thousand without giving me a ticket free? It's very easy. You can calculate the fuel, how much use, we are not a stupid, and everything else. So now the cost of the fuel is extremely expensive. Zero. And the aircraft carriers, 747, how much does for your car worth? 200 pound? That's the one that. A 200 pound can take you, it's about 250 euro, can take you to New York. You don't like it, you leave it behind. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so, at no cost, all of you are the passengers of at least this atmosphere at zero cost. Los Angeles, here I come. Breakfast in Los Angeles, teaching in the morning here. You'll be totally confused, man. I don't know what you're going to do. But this is what is about to happen. It's not too about to happen. It's happened. Now it's in your hand, not mine. This is not something which is going to be, it is happening right in your, under your eyes, under your nose. And in fact, we are going to five and we're stuck at one and two. Marco, you're not burning enough. The more you burn, the more high, the more I look. He looks better, not me. Yeah, but let, let it go natural. Let it go naturally because if you let it go naturally, you don't have to burn nothing. Just the DC stays constant, and then the AC. Anytime you put an appliance for AC, it goes triple. Like you can get like. If you put AC, it goes higher. Yeah, it goes higher. You get okay. more. You get more. More AC. Now, if you put AC, you get. Uh, it puts more into the grid. Ah, you pay more. So the more Once you, you, you don't pay AC, more, you, you get put more. more up. Yeah, you get more energy. I mean, you put more energy into the grid. Yeah. Okay. I understand. So because if you create the gravitation yes. of it, you have a free magnetic hole, which okay. gives up. And then if you understood this in another language tonight, if you made star formations, put one of these on top of it, control how many kettles of tea you put on, you can fly to. Because now you control the reactor. He's very busy with something. No, I'm, sorry, I'm just want to try this, look at this. This is the cigarette butt. This is Armand's this. job. Yeah, Armand gave him a cigarette <laughs> butt. Now he's trying to do it I in self tissue works. box. No, I want to see if it works before I go, because I'm just, just want to go home and you not think about nothing. You are a cause of a lot of problem, Armand, but you've done a lot of good. We'll see where it goes. But the, was the cigarette butt smoked or not? Is there any nicotine? No, it wasn't in it? smoked. It was just... Are you sure it wasn't smoked? No, it wasn't smoked. Fresh. Fresh. Okay. So now you see this is a problem. He comes here to teach and he carries on. We'll never learn anything from you in London. We bring you here. <laughs> no, that's different. If I'm he to goes to doing there. something and if for that teacher, students waiting. No, no, but well, you're there. You're there. So I don't, you're talking. No, 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 just, no, I, I don't, don't want to be sitting down doing nothing. I don't, I'm not used to sitting down doing nothing. So Can I sit down I do. for a haircut? Um, you have a scissors? No, 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 no. <laughs>
<laughs> no, that's not good enough. That's not good enough. <laughs> you have given me a brain fart since yesterday. <laughs> it's a pleasure to see men who can change the history of man in a very simple way, and they are still humble enough to be able to be a still a man. And it's a pleasure to work with him since yesterday. There he goes, Armand, the second one. We're just gathering in there. Yeah, but I want to put this on for the Carry on, carry on, carry on. Carry on, carry on. So, what do you see? He's still pushing. Let's see. Can we smoke it? No. Can you smoke You're burning it? it. So, if it's in a cigarette bottle, we can smoke it. No, you can't. Well, you want to try? You don't smoke, so <laughs> you want to try? Why not? It's good for a change. No, man. I don't want to. I don't want you dead. I want you, you alive. You never know. I, I want you alive so I can learn more from you. It might get me high. Oh no, you don't have. You don't. You already high. Twenty four seven high. How can a man stand on his feet all day long and then you say you know high? You high. Oh. <laughs> you high by nature. <laughs> 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 Next step to this is to understand he's actually making a cigarette roll, huh? Is that it? Yeah. I want to try that. that. Pardon? The picture is too bright. There's too much light in the background. Turn off the lights, no problem. So, um, it doesn't make any difference. I think. The, he says, if he's on his computer, good. How come we are so dark there? Uh, Mr. Cash, I'm supposed to remind you of the time. Pardon? I'm supposed to remind you of the time. What's the time, please? What's it, the time? I don't know what it is for you, but it's 8.30 for me, so that's usually meaning it's four, about... Four, uh, four, it's four, about 4.30. Four, four, okay, four i tell you why I asked you, and you know the reason. We have, um, uh, we would like, I'm going to ask you first, Rick and Vince, can we carry this through to tomorrow here? Or can we support it with the Chinese taking over that they can demonstrate it's too dark? Bolio, uh, Bolio. Oh, I understand this very good. Yeah. So, um, if you can support, it's too dark. It's too dark. Too dark. I've gone that dark. Can you imagine what's happened with Alex? You won't see. It will be a shadow. Only. <laughs> so what happens is that Can we get, excuse me, gentlemen, can we stop this discussion? It's too much noise in the background. The, we can carry on with other people who have started the test around the world to carry on with the teaching. We don't stop. Has anybody, do you see anybody on the lines to say they have started testing? Or I, I do see people? things on Facebook. Pardon? Sorry, you just have to give me a moment because I'm actually building as we're talking. <laughs> you are building as we are talking. This is no good, Armand. It should be the other way up. This is too much light. It should be the other way. We should blind it. Yeah, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up. Yeah, that's what we need. The other way, the same. It's too much light. So can we carry on? Or do we need to change position to the new uh, center? Because it involves a lot of moving, shifting things. And uh, if it's possible, 
can we do it? We can stay here till seven o'clock and then we hand it over to you and the Chinese and then the others to carry on at least teaching each other, developing each other. I stay in the background if I can. Uh, we have a problem with our communication lines everywhere that we see this not to stop. If we stop it, then to start again tomorrow, it'll be totally different. We've done this. Can we go through a process of linking up with different countries of the Cash Foundation? Uh, yeah, let's... Uh... We can Sorry. certainly try, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I've been talking at exactly the same time, which is normal for us, I think. What is it? Go ahead, Rick. Well, I think we can certainly try, is what I said. So, if you can share the load, because not many people know how to use the systems between you two. We get a number of people around the world to start building the systems and they report it back on the Skype or Facebook or anything else. We need to create repetition to break the stronghold on the energy and uh, what do you call? Okay, I would like to make a call then that uh, anybody that's been listening for the last seven hours, um, especially the knowledge seekers that are building at the moment because I see pictures, if you could please get in contact with somebody um, that you can come on to the meeting and uh, and continue on with what you've done and what you found out, that would be much appreciated. Uh, so people that I've already seen posting in Facebook uh, their few creations, uh, I would invite you on, please. Because we need to reproduce at least in five countries and feed into the power supply, at least in five countries, that we can go from one state to the next. I explained to you why five. There it is. Why don't you shoot on camera? Show it on camera. Oh, well, the amp, I'm just wanting to show the, the amp is increasing. The amperage is increasing or is going down, is 40, must be 39. That's milliamp, yeah? Yeah. And, and then uh, what about the voltage? Uh, the voltage is about seven point something volts. Can we see the voltage? About five point um, five point thirty two thirty four. Half a volt and. But it seems that that number doesn't really mean anything when it comes yeah, in. Um, That's true. In terms, in terms of the uh, thing, it doesn't mean nothing. It can be zero, but still it's going to do the job. Yes, because, because it he absorbs the plant. You yeah. lot are Break. learning. Fantastic. It's matter dependent. Wow. Yeah. We are yeah, coming to the schizophrenic house. Yeah. Yeah, I suck, I suck in. yeah, but you know, when you soak it and then it dries it, it comes back to the same thing. Um, Mr. Cash? Yes. I, I think we have a special guest here. Um, it looks like we have the Chinese that have the Fat Boy Reactor online. Yes, let's have him on. And then, because I tell you why, not only because of the Fat Boy, it's fantastic what he's put on. Uh, hello, Fat Boy. How is he? Is he getting any fatter or fitter? You know, you know what's really funny about this is that uh, he has a bad network connection, and he's right beside his reactor. It looks like, so he might have to move away from his reactor to be able to broadcast. <laughs> okay, uh, has he achieved anything? Let me tell you why. This afternoon or today, when I was talking to Alex, he said, "I know what I'm going to do when I go back to England with a fat boy. I can do something with it." Can you tell our Chinese friend what to do with his fat boy? Yeah, you, um, you can incorporate the system into your fat boy. He wants you to, the, 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 Mr. Zhang, Zhang, if I'm correct, what Alex is suggesting or he's going to do is to, co to what, to cooperate? So, yeah, to incorporate the system into your fat boy. What do you do? Let's okay, I'll leave it to you. I can sit down. 
See, can you do it on the board? Do it on the board. I want to Okay. I can I can take my car away, and you can do it here. Explain it here because just people can see. Okay, if fat boy, and then fat boy, his this yeah. This is the his nano coated the the surface, isn't it? His nano coated both sides, and inside us, and outside. He told us he's getting um, 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 overload from the resistance there. So yeah, it takes eight ohms. Okay, if it turns this. Hello, just wait one second. Once there's something going on in the back. Ah, it's a uh, uh, cameraman. Okay, carry on. Okay, if it takes um, if it turns this one into if it um, sorry. if it connects the well, um the um negative of this to this positive, and then instead of using the Gauss reactor. The gun um, set up as the um, um, battery or whatever I was using it for. You just create a cell, mix a cell, and then connect it to to a system to run. It's going to get a lot of power out. Okay, that's that's what I think. Okay, no, 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 no. You spoke my language. Now I speak their language. How can I speak Chinese? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> No, right, no. So. no, 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 okay. no, learn. You're going to be a teacher. You better understand. Okay. None of us understand your language. Okay. Otherwise, you'd be like me. Okay. We'd be two cuckoos well, speaking. Your language, so. Okay. You understand my language and all others. This boy, mm -hmm. a fat boy, yeah. has brought changes like you into the game. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, I understand you. I interpret. Okay. Okay. I, we, I, uh, I know. Please. I know English, English, Chinese. Just wait there. Just stay there. Don't move. Okay. Can we see a big picture of the fat boy? Can you expand on it by any chance? Okay. You see, it's inside this coated the it's coated the reactor, and then it's coated the reactor inside out. To, to the guns, connected with the guns um, to run it. Is using a gas to run it. Yeah, I think so. Ah. Uh, Shenkao, can you can you um, <coughs> excuse me? Can you translate for us to get the to get the message across, or or somebody on the Chinese side? Do we have uh, Lisa on the on the Hello? line? Hi, Lisa. Hello? Yep, there yes. she is. Um, is that Lisa? Yeah, I, yes. Hi. Mr. Hi, Lisa, darling. Listen, uh, can you? Uh huh. Yes. The fat boy is doing. I I, th I told him uh, get close, uh, shot on the fat boy, but I don't know. He, if he... Okay, now he is. Is he producing energy from the fat boy? Uh, yes, uh, I think we said, uh, uh, I don't know, it's, it was Wins or Rick. He has a, a file, PDF file, indicate how the energy come out from the fat boy and uh, against box. I don't understand. No, I'm saying, saying here. Do you understand? Anybody no, can understand. I'm just ask her. Is this the guns, the gun setup that supplies power to the fat boy? Lisa? Lisa. Is this the guns reactor that supplies power to the fat boy or is just? Uh, the guns, uh, no, it's different type of guns. It's, he uses it's... different type of guns. Well, how does is he running the reactor? How does he run the reactor from the main or using the guns? Uh, the the uh, the uh, reactor he he's using uh, just a a motor. He connected to the uh, yeah he's using, using the motor. The main power. Okay. Yeah. Well, if right. then if you put the system into it, it's going to be the same. Then what? As if you put the system into it, it's yeah. going to be the same. 
because you can add a system to indicate. Okay, what, what Alex says, if we collaborate with both ways, the system will be the same. So that's a fat boy. If he connects the north and the south to the beads as a load. Okay. Am I correct? Yeah. Don't forget what he uses the terminology. He uses the gravitational magnetic field, gravitational magnetic field, not magnetical magnetic field as a load, as what it takes creates gravity. So he connects the core to there. And then yes. what does he do with the motor? How do, does he feed his motor? Um, no, the motor is, is to, the, um, to the main. To the, grid, to the main, and then he just connects the poles to the thing. So he can control the lift and coming up and down. Now. Hopefully. Fat boy, you're flying. Sure, sure, he's going to fly. <laughs> Understand what he explains. He is <laughs> controlling. If he can reduce the load, he will increase the magnetic. magnetical field, and then it creates a gravitational push. The Earth gravitational field force will force the separation. So, if he, if you could ask him, Lisa, and he has understood how he made, the, how Alex made the double loop of beads, and he can connect it. He will do exactly what we showed with the star formation to control the lift. Much more compact, central. Boy, fat boy, you should be on flight condition by Tuesday, open teaching. And maybe and even more faster. You Chinese guys are running very fast. And, and then, if you can make the beads, by tomorrow morning, place it on top of your core. You control the core dimension field. Most probably you fly, irrespective of your short circuit. Do you want to translate this, sir? Uh, OK. Uh, uh, the, the big boy to central core, or he connects it to the outer core, dictating lift or landing. You are very worried about that boiling water. Ah, uh, Marco, we have no more tea if that gets destroyed. We have to close the university no and no more casting. A little bit left. A spaceship institute without caustic and hot water is no spaceship institute. It's taken us a long time to find this cattle. We are entering into five and one and a half for just. Yeah, no, it's about four and a half and five. Very interesting is that as it gets loaded, we get a flash of light here. So about one and a half, let's say to four and a half, we are supplying three times more into the grid than what we are taking. It's a big ratio. So if you take 100 kilowatts, you put 300 kilowatt back in. If you connect such a system to an industrial unit which uses one megawatt of energy a year, you can see how much you'll put back into the country while it's getting energy free. 
By the way, you can tell your friends, the Italians, for the battery, they can come in, but they make a very good donation to the foundation. Every three batteries they produce, they sell, one battery goes free to Africa. Sure. So tell him to come, we got to show. Yeah, no problem. So we'll see. We have to be able to create employment. With this technology, if they cannot go to China, the Chinese will support. The whole object is to create employment in every nation. But unfortunately in Africa, we have to support. They don't even have a cutting machine in some of the nations. We robbed, we didn't put anything back. Now they give us a gift like this today. We have no obligation, but we have plenty of free hands to do what we wanted to do with free energy. You know, a lot of uh, energy magazines criticize us for not being able, not delivering because of the fear of shelving and destruction of the technology, we didn't do. Now the technology is free. Anybody has got a doubt, they can build the system up themselves and see how it uses, how it feeds back. And it's not a theory because now two houses in the United Kingdom in London, which is very important, are getting supplied with the same simple circuit and then more or less a ping pong ball for past eight weeks. The supplies to a grid, not the users of the grid. This is not what the energy companies like, but to a third world nations and to the developing nations, if the cash foundations around the world are correct, is the gift to your nation. It's part of the free patent. It's part of the free technology teaching. And uh, I wonder if the people who yesterday were with us, they can be with us today who wanted to bring the change, and they said they have the contact to bring the change. Or are the people in the background afraid of the what is to come? Don't forget, when NASA, when there was a problem with the space station, some three, four years ago, because of the loss of some launches and no shuttle, the Cash Foundation at that time offered support to bring astronauts back on Earth. So in the coming days, we open the book. You will show and we tell you how it would have been done. The science is with us. The science is with the hand of the, one of the most capable scientists I know at the Iranian government's hand. And now I'm sure Russians and the Iranians will open the book of plasma technology because compared to what we have here that you understand, this is a child's play. In the advancement of knowledge, they have reached and they have achieved. So in so many ways, if you go back, go to understanding of deuterium, now, you can place cups of water, cups of whatever you like, in the center of this core. Make it to be the strength of fat, protein, banana. Ooh, I'm getting hot, Marco. Woo, I'm getting a steam done. Switch it up, okay. Your bar is showing itself. So what you do, you saw the physical presentation of this with our Chinese. How they put a protein and CO2 and the rest and they received water, and they had a taste of the water. Change the loading of your reactors 
in the food energy level of everyday consumption you need, place water in the center, you receive your daily dosage of energy. Much simpler. In fact, what you got to do if you go further is Thank you for coming. Now that you have learned the energy transfer from a system to matter state, get yourself a cup and make bands on it. Make the cups the way I did, with the beads. Nourish your soul, your heart, your stomach, your arms and legs. This is the health cup which I use instead of magnetic field. Now you put your daily dosage in your tanks, anywhere in the universe. You need to be in the center of it because you are the water yourself. You understand? Can I ask a question? No, we can't. Just wait, be patient. I'm very ruthless because I have a point to make. You disturb, yes. I can't. So if you place yourself now in this material here in the center, you have made the beads mm -hmm. and you make one gravitational, one magnetical. One gravitational, one magnetical. Don't forget there are beads. You remember my magnets on the cup? You don't need even to drink from it. You just walk in it. I like fish and chips today. The combination of the plasma is fish and chips. I feel I had a fish and chips. Would like with soul finger or soul finger? Soul finger. I tell you the joke about the soul finger later on. In England, when you go to get a fish and chips, they ask you, do you want a salt and vinegar on it? But we have so many lovely Chinese in England. They can't say salt and vinegar. Soul finger, and you say, yes, please, the left one, please. <laughs> So he understands the joke. That's why I said you want a sore finger or salt and vinegar. So you go in, you decide. You got cancer with less than one dollar, the new health system comes in operation. That's what I said. Don't touch that acupuncture needle. You're playing with people's life. Because when you enter this zone in this condition, the body takes what it needs because it's at an MRI bank. Any DNA adjustment will be done. Any RNA adjustment according to the base will be done. Go back to the agricultural teaching about the wheat and how you put it in the gans, and then you can go back to the origin. Perfect life without any disease. You have it for the first time in your hand. But you gotta watch how long you stay in the cup, how long you stay in the environment. Because if you go too far, you become a caveman before you know it. Yes. You think it only happens to the weed? It happens to you too. Yes, madam. Would you like that long hair and <laughs> Bill is good at it. <laughs> Just don't go far back to become a rib. That's all. <laughs> so, the case. Yeah. pardon? Uh, uh, I think there are two points that are not so clear that I would like 
to Who's speaking. It's Vitor. Vitor. Hi, Vitor, darling. How are you? How are you? <laughs> Fine, thanks. Um, uh, I have to. Uh, I want to. I would like to know about uh, the negative to the negative connection because it was not explained. There's a, a scheme. It could be clear to understand. Also, or, I'm, I'm talking about the inner negative. inner ring. Sorry. Negative to negative. The the the, the inner the inner ring. How is it to yes. connect between the the? Yeah. What happened here? He does two wires. It's not one wire. He does one here, which is the negative, back to the positive. And then he puts a second negative from the same plate to the negative of the second uh, body unit. As I said, here you don't look at negative to positive. This is a transfer of energy to feed itself. This is a closed circuit. In a way, if you look at this, it's like Earth, North Pole and South Pole fields always continuously and taking whatever it comes in the environment with it to itself. So it's a supply power. That I, I understood. Your absorption. Pardon? That, that I, I can understand. Uh, uh, what I mean is how it connects uh, the inner ring uh, uh, small batteries. I, I, don't, I don't remember the name. I'll call it small batteries. The inner ring are connected negative to the negative. Is is the yes, outside the gravitational uh, pull? It's the outside of the the the, the battery. No, what it does? The outside of the other. No, battery. no, 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 Victor. Let me explain to you for you to understand. Here he connected the negative to positive. Here he connects the whole loop. Whatever he connects to the negative. Actually, he connects it to the positive leg, which was now become the supply line. Understand okay. very carefully. Okay, so and there are in of, series. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Sorry. Sorry. If you understand this, not just you, but it goes further step. In plasma technology, you create a demand, and when you create a demand, you create a supply to satisfy. Here, he creates a demand by this circle, by closing this circuit, because whatever comes, then he creates a demand to go out to supply. So the inner ring becomes to come to meet the demand. This is the supplier to meet the demand for that, and as this reduces, allows the magnetical field to supply the grid. This is where you look at it matter state, you have to look at it in the plasma state. Everything here is plasmatic. If you could make a perfect circle unit, you will have a perfect control in dimensions as well. Exactly what, as I said, Professor Mile has done. The shape of your figures will make difference. The shape of your rings will make difference. So here, you create a demand by short circuiting. And because of this demand, you meet the demand by what you absorb from the environment through the guns of the material. Don't think in a matter state. Think about condition creating 129. The more you create, listen to what he said. The time, as the time goes, you supply more. Because the more you drain the environment of the lower level, now the more higher levels are available to catch. That's how you increase the power. Because you get rid of, it's just like, uh, what do you call it? Uh, the, the more power you want, the more you, you take off. You take it off. You empty of the lower order, the higher order becomes available, and this becomes your supply. That's what it does. But when he goes directly to the load, now he controls what he takes and what he puts out. 
is the difference between connecting here and connecting there. It's a fundamentally different. Here he controls the gravitational field. Here he controls the energy field. It's a two different system embedded in the one. So your energy system and your flight system. Here he drains the energy to give for power. Here he gains the energy to control the altitude and position of gravitational magnetic field. Listen to what I said. Maybe you did not hear, maybe I didn't explain myself clearly. When we spoke about Tesla and Professor Mile, and what I explained to you about the ring position, Professor Mile sells two units, power unit and energy unit. Something you want to get work done, something you want to transfer information. Gravitational or magnetical, but limited by matter state of the copper and the ring and the size of the ball. Here, you don't have that problem. If you connect this way, as I said, the big boy, the fat boy, is both gravitational and magnetical. Depends if you feed into the center. The problem, the beauty with the big boy, and I'm sure this guy is gonna hit it very big in lift, is that here you rely on another system to give you this. In a big boy, this is embedded inside. You have both gravitational and magnetical in the cover of the skin inside out, because inside layer of the coating is your gravitational, outside is magnetical, and then you have your supply and stuff that right in the center. You decide how much you give, how much you take. It's one of the most efficient ways, but then you can connect the outside and inside together. You have a lift system or you have a power system. This so is the to, to get it right. Uh, if, I, if I understood, uh, so the, the, the inner ring is like an expansion of the bottom uh, cell in the simpler uh, star formation. No, no, no. It, it, this, the mini cell, which is uh, the, the one uh, yes. Alex represented in his hand, yeah. the yes. bottom one in the drawing, in the, in the, the screen, or, uh, the bottom one the who has drawing. the loop, who has the loop, which you, you, you referred yes, to as, the, as the Earth. Yeah. Yes, thank yes. you. Yes. This one is uh, an, a kind of ex an expansion uh, in the inner ring. It's like the same, but in the inner ring, uh, in a series of little batteries that get go to in a, in a loop itself yes okay. yeah so in a way uh, you have to understand this in a very very effective way and if you know how to mix it uh, he uses uh, let's expand on something very nice i think it's time to do a little bit of expansion then we'll go. As I said, you went into a specific material he uses. Now you choose your material in the lining as we seen here. You see in that direction. But let's open this. If this is the bottom one, if you start developing the right way, you will make rings of your GANS materials. What you can do in these rings, you can use GANS materials of a lower to a higher order. So you amplify the energy very rapidly in your system. So you can change one with the totality of that. We talked about this yesterday or the day before, the day before when I was teaching you, about the universal box or the Fukushima box. How you can make composite materials from the same thing. You've seen today with uh, Alex,
the composite components. You make the composite, and according to its strength, you can load up your circuit. You can choose where you want to load up. That at the end, it'll be powerful, lower or higher. This is a plasmatic amplifiers. In one of the pattern sections, this has been referred to. Then you can use the same kind of amplifier in suddenly increasing the uh, strength of the inner plasma to lift. That's how it's done in the space technology. That's how you see a UFO, suddenly you get a flash of light and it disappears because the controller decides on the speed of transfer of the plasma. He doesn't change pressure. You've seen it in systems, rotation is irrelevant. He increases the power in a rapid way into the system. He already have access to what? This is a thousand times the speed of light. This is 40 times the speed of light with 20 meter diameter protection. This is a thousand times the speed of light with one kilometer transfer of uh, resistance or what do you call it, magnetic field to give him protection. So for the first time, you understand how you control your flight system. This is a cruel way. This is a very, very basic understanding of it. Now, you know how you, uh, I told you last this week, how to make the Fukushima box, how to make different kind of materials. And now, if you start layering this, you can even layer this material layer by layer in what you choose from the center core. This is, a, this is the opening door. You haven't just got in. You have opened the door and now we teach more. You can create layers of it. Different tissue papers, different ways, but this is a start. Because you cannot change the magnetical gravitational field reloading yourself again. Every time your reactor, you reload through parameters of the energy, gravitational magnetic field of your amplifiers or your systems. You see it? Huh? You go layer by layer this way to increase your power. Yeah, I think, I've, okay. done, I think I've done um, the, the layered version of it. I did up to three layers and then I had... Is it okay? Can you hear him? No problem. Yeah, I did the layered version of it and then I had um, good feedback. You had a good feedback. So yeah. you already achieved you in that direction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you mix them, you amplify it, you reduce it, you connect lines together in a plasmatic condition. So now the game is expanding very rapidly. I want to know if the Chinese will have the fat boy flying by tomorrow. Hopefully. Do you know what you can do, boys, in the, the fat boy, Mr. Zhang? Make one of these systems, use the last layer Okay, I'll show it to you on your fat boy, it's easier. This is your fat boy. If you understood this, make the rate of speed around this. But make sure your last layer is 100% a nano-coated material that you do not create electrical current, electron transfer. Then you can compress the gravitational magnetic field literally by a small control on your beads. And then you can decide which beads will be magnified you dictate the direction of the flight or the flow. This is one of the simplest way to create control. Because if you decide to control this and this in a certain way, this is the direction you fly. If you control this speed and this speed, this is the direction you go fly. But this is very advanced. 
or that's the way. If you put the beads, at least you can create a condition of lifting yourself and landing. At least we can start with that. While you're producing a lot of energy. You can transfer the knowledge from beads, the way you have it over the reactors in three star formation, into closed star formation, as I said, as a flat on top of the core. Now you have three dimensional control in how you fly. Bring the system control in operation, which is inevitable in the coming time anyway. As I explained, Fat Boys has been one of the oldest system well tested in the space. But now you look into a further development of the control of the direction. Shouldn't it be activated or just um, I have to hook it up? This one. If it's this one, you want to activate my emotional part, my physical part, you want to, to replace my heart valve to be in the direction of the flow of the energy you can have. You don't activate the rest, but you still activate them enough that because don't forget all these organs depend on the heart valve. So they have a connection with it. Yeah? So you want to change the muscle or the tissue of a liver, which is cancer, you change one of the beads which covers that area in field, no cancer. What you do, you increase is gravitational or magnetical. You transfer energy of the cancer cell outside the system, no cancer milliseconds. The game you opened up and this is just the beginning. Okay. Thank you very much for coming. All right. So what is the decision? Are we going to carry on here without moving the reactors and we leave it to the others and the knowledge seekers can stay on home or wherever, we keep on adding to the knowledge because we've been here. And we ask you, please start producing as many beads and start supplying your country, your nation to become independent in energy supply. We are already still at one to two, we're coming to two, but we are at five already achieving the five. You wanna go closer? You still at two and a half times energy, which is very good. But the more faster we go, yeah, the better yeah. it gets tomorrow. We see how far we can push it. So, what is the decision from the, the masters? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. We open the questions. Let's, if there are any questions, let's answer some. I'm not going to answer. We're going to leave it to you. Have a mic. Have a mic. Are there any questions? Hello, Mr. Keshe. Um, is there a circuit for the connection of the uh, watt meters, please? The in I, I, we can hear. Can you repeat? Is there a circuit diagram for the energy meters showing the kilowatts, the in and this out? This sounds like Emmanuel from yes, yes. Uh, Malta. Yes, how are you? Hi, Emmanuel. Hi, how are you? And how are you, Alex? All right. Oh, very good. <laughs> Tell me the question, please. Um, is there a circuit uh, for the watt meters showing the input and output so that we install a watt meter also? Yeah, this is your job. Is there a watt meter for input and output? No, no. Um, is there a circuit for the watt meters? The they connect it in the. Yeah, he wants to know, know if there is a circuit that can use the voltage measure. The voltage the he is asking about the power meters, not the volt meter. The watt meters, yeah, the power meters. Uh, Mr. Oh. Keshe, the power meters that are connected um, in the in the in the lecture room over there. I don't understand. True, I don't understand what you're saying. 
But if, if you're talking about a meter, the wall meter at home. The, no, no, the power meter here. Okay, um, I'm seeing the two power meters, the in and out. Um, uh, if they can supply the um, circuit diagrams, how, how they are connected, you know? I know one understands what he's saying, so you can explain to me. Okay, I think he, I understand. He, yeah. He, I think I understand. He wants to know the circuit diagram of the measuring equipment that you're using for in and out. Oh, uh, oh okay, okay. I understand now. Uh, that socket, I didn't, I didn't make it. Um, we had an electrician got it made yesterday. But Mr. Cash can um, can link you up with the electrician if you want um, the diagram. Okay, okay. Maybe tomorrow. Okay, thank you, Alex. All right. And about the connection for the car, um, Alex, are the both beads, the gravitational and magnetical, have to be connected also with the reactor? Um, can you come again? Okay. Um, when you connected the cigarette lighter, okay, yeah. Yeah. Um, you also co you connected the beads the outer and the inner, okay? The gravitational, the inner, and the outer, magnetic, the magnetical. Yeah. Uh, both have, have to be connected? Yeah, just the same way it is here. Same I way? Mean, just okay. the same way, there's no change. Same, the same, the same um, uh, system. That's same, the same way system. and, okay. Yeah. And also have to add a one reactor to that. You have to add what? A reactor, also the, the ball. Okay, uh, the ping pong ball also yeah, I use has the to be connected. Ball. I use the ping pong ball reactor. Okay, and uh, can, can what, what guns are you using in the ping pong balls? Um, what guns did I use in that ping pong ball? I think it's um, composite guns. No, it's some um, CO2 guns with a strength of banana. Pardon? CO2 guns with a strength of banana. Okay. So, you know what so that means? which means if you make a CO2 box and you put a banana on top of it, you get you get the strength of banana in the CO2. Uh, okay. So you it's CO2 and banana. Yeah. Not inside. Don't put the banana yes, inside. Yeah. You have to top. leave it on top of it. And then you're going to attract the feet of the banana into the CO2. So what I'm um, what I want to make clear is that you are using the same gas in the tank and in the in the reactor. Okay, so the, in the tank you use CO two gas. Yeah, but I think, sorry, I think reactor. you can use you can use any gas actually because it doesn't really it's the fuel that matters. It's not the gas itself. No, no, in the tank and the petrol and the fuel you put CO two gas, fifty milliliters. Oh, in the tank. In on the, the tank, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but uh, this thing, it's a half tank. Oh, no, it's a quarter tank that I used. It's not a full tank, so it's a quarter tank of um, petrol. And every time you, you fill it up, um, do you have to put more guns? I don't put more guns. I just top up. That's it. Yeah, because I added, I put the guns in, um, in December, and then ever since then, I've not added no guns since December. So practically, the guns remain there. They mm. don't get wasted, you know. Yeah, this thing, it's not, it's not the same CO2 ganses that have, I have in the reactor that I have in, the, um, in my car. In the car, in the, in the, um, in the petrol tank, I use uh, the plain CO2, nothing with no strength, just ordinary CO2. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Thank you very much, and uh, I congratulate you. All right, thank you. Maybe we can close now. With the plates. Oh yeah. How do you do that? Yeah, so what I would I would like to add is um maybe we'll keep the the live stream. Uh, the YouTube going and um, uh, 
and we'll just have it on pause, but we'll keep the Zoom going as well so that uh, if people want to come on that have made devices, that, then we can turn the YouTube back on and, uh, and people can share. Yeah. yeah, but when I use when I use the banana guns, it gives me a different strength when I when I put them. Okay, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So can we close now? Okay. <laughs> <Don't know. laughs> All right, um. Amon just told me, if you want to energize your CO2, the best way to do it is to use um, nano-coated uh, plates to do it. If you put place one nano-coated material here, and next one here, it's going to get energized. I think... I think we should close and go home now because I want to come to your place again. <laughs> Any more questions or shall we go? Vince? Okay, I think uh, maybe we should uh, take a break here, eh, Vince, and uh, uh, do a little regrouping. Yeah. Yeah, we could take a, a break and come back. I, I can always schedule another live event if, you, if everybody wants to follow the Cash Foundation uh, YouTube, then we can see it there. Um, also, I'm sure that there'll be posts under Facebook. And of course, uh, the video will always be available after we're done the live event and you can come in and catch up as you need to. Um, maybe that's a good idea, Rick, so we can everybody can take a little break and, um, and regroup with their thoughts. Uh, we'll be th still here on uh, Skype, so uh, let us know uh, if there's anybody uh, on, on the knowledge seekers that want to present their newly created devices. Okay. Okay. So we'll, cl so we'll close the li live stream down, I guess, right, for now? Is that the well, idea? I is it possible that we can leave the uh, camera on? With it focused on the um, on the on the drawing power on the meter on the, the power meter. yeah on the in and out of the power meters. Well, we have to ask them. Maybe the oh, yeah. Marco, is uh, okay. Okay, it says yes. Because that way, if I uh, if we leave that on, then we can dynamically come back to it and check it out and uh, and include that into uh, parts yeah, of in, yes. the video as well. Uh, question. Yeah. If, when you uh, put the reactor inside the, the car. The car mm. um, okay. Just might need it's some light. <laughs> Keep the lights on. <laughs> Because it's it'll nano. make a long video. It's it'll a loop. It's many, nano. many uh, when you gigabytes. Uh, it's it's going to be hard to deal with it later. Um, yeah, I have a motor that in the reactor that runs. I have um, a fan motor. I put the ping pong ball on top of the motor, and yeah. then I, I did this configuration to the cigarette. The, the rotor uh, inside at the Oh, the, the, uh, the reactor inside of the CO2 has um, ganses, yeah, it has ganses. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah, no, 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 it's, a, no, it's dynamic, dynamic, which means um, nano, CO, nano um, CO2, dry CO2, and um, the, um, the normal gans itself. You know, if you're okay. making the layering. Dry liquid. So. Yeah, dry liquid and the one you treat with caustic. You know, you take you know, caustic. and the caustic one, you know, because uh, the nano nano guns are internal and external, so all internal. No, listen, the guns. Can, can you explain to the board so the people understand? Okay, so he's asking me if I'm um, sorry. He asked if I have um if if um, I added guns to the. To the reactor in the, in the car, 
Okay, yes, I put dances in the reactor. It's dynamic. I, had, um, I mean, it's layered. I had three layers of it, which means the dry, the dry um, guns of it, and then the nano one, and then the normal guns. The three layers, the three layers of it. So that, that's all. Which means one, with, one treated with caustic, and one normal, and then one dried. So that's, that's what is talking the thing. And then it's a motor, this normal. Hmm? I, know, I didn't put no caustic dust. I just did um, a nano. Uh, okay, if I caught it. No, no, no. Okay. Okay, okay. So that's all. That's all anyway. And put the motor, connect it with the with the circuit uh, with the nano wire uh, to uh, minus and minus four. Just the same way it is here. That is the same way I put in car. Where's the socket? Where's the little one? I show you. You see this one? Yes. This is the negative. Yeah, and yes. this is the positive. So yes. this this and this one goes into the cigarette lighter. Yes. And this one and this one goes to the reactor. This one? And this one. This is the negative, this is the positive. So the reactor, this one has to go to the negative of the reactor, and this one is positive of the reactor. And then this one and this one here, same po positive. Ah, positive same. and negative yeah, go this to is the reactor. reactor. Yeah. And negative and negative go to the no. No negative and negative. There is a problem in the explication. No, it's, not, it's not a problem. Maybe you don't understand yeah. that. Look at this. This is the cigarette lighter. OK. Yes. This is your cell. Yes. This is minus. This is plus. OK. This goes to cigarette lighter. Mm -hmm. Yes. This goes to motor. And then it comes to the cigarette lighter. Ah, you understand? So what it has, whatever it's left, it goes back to your generator. Ah, mostly. You understand? Okay. Sure. So this is your reactor. Okay, it's raw. Rotate because it's 12 volt, whatever it needs. Hey, Armin, can we get you a microphone? Because it's, it's really hard to hear you through um, the reactor. From here. Is, is there I'm anybody still listening there at the SSI? Let me do it So, this motor. Uh, positive or negative? Positive and, um, yeah, yes. yeah, positive and negative. Hello. Do you hear me? Yeah, could you get Armin a uh, uh, microphone? Because it's really hard to hear him through. Um, um, Armin, could you speak to microphone somehow? Or? Oh, okay. You want uh, to explain to microphone? And we would like to. You just yelled into the microphone too loud and it <laughs> overloaded it and it stopped uh, transmitting. Wait, I tell him and then he explained to me. Is yeah, that okay? I tell him and he That's better. Say it again. Sorry, we didn't catch any of that. You were too close to the mic. Um, if we want to follow the meters, we have to change the position of the camera, so we have to stop it for a while. Is that okay? No mechanics, so I don't know. <laughs> uh, well, I was just thinking about zooming it into the meter. No, it's not possible to zoom it. Uh, the position of the camera now is not, not Yeah, it right becomes lighter, and, uh, than even when you drive it. Can we do? Sure, no problem. No, okay. You want to, okay. Like you want to fly, it's, easy, it's very light. Guys, can I speak a bit? Yeah, but could yeah. you could you ask Armin to repeat that on microphone? That that was really. You can feel, you can feel it's light. Just go straight. Uh -huh. But it's not it's not levitating. It doesn't levitate. But it's just light. No, it doesn't levitate. Yeah, 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 yeah
Sorry? Live stream registration, registrato. Io credo no, solo per vedere no, no, no. Ah, perché in the other video in the live stream. Play. 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 E go. Video. Go video. Yeah. What's wrong? Sono tutti i video in live stream. Ad esempio, live stream the morning. Cioè, mai stato fatto. Se io voglio rivedere, posso rivedere? Sì, sì. Play? Sì, play. Quindi registrato, registrato il video. Se io posso vedere... No, anche, anche no, anche senza registrare. In automatic posso vedere? Io, io credo. Ci sono. Quindi... Ah, Come on. I think that's that's a, that's a good thing is going to work, you know. The internet this connection is thing is going to work. Mr. Look, Cash computer yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, it's going to work. 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 Yeah, it's going Yes. Yeah, 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 I can hear you. Sorry, we're just listening to the conversation. We're trying to listen to Alex too. Can you make sure that microphone that you're holding is with Armin? What is it? Sorry, sorry. Uh, we just so hear a, half a conversation with Alex and yourself as well, so it's a little confusing. Um, maybe it's better if we just mute you and uh, and we continue this. Or it, are you guys still going to be there for a little bit? What you want me to do? <laughs> I think you were uh, too close to the mic there, Armin. Oh, oh, what we are discussing? oh we were too, too, too close. Oh, okay, okay. Kit. Just switch this off. It's off? Oh, I hear you loud and clear. I muted them there. Thank you. Um, so maybe we should just uh, say uh, that's it. I will um, periodically turn this on, see what we can do about um, uh, keeping updates happening regularly. And uh, we'll see where we have to go. I'm sure there's many people that are building frantically. Sounds good, Vince. Uh... Yeah, we'll take a break and uh, check back in later. Sorry, guys, can I say a bit? Uh, a bit? Sure. Um, I was uh, looking when there was, uh, you know, to to for this Fukushima box, and uh, you know when they're putting the outside of the box, uh, the container, I mean, uh, the plates, and uh, what um, Alex said, like you put banana on top. Actually, we can use the same things with the plates. We don't need to put outside. We can just put on on top of the water, and you just don't touch the water. Like I mean, like you buy a layer, kind of covering the box. You understand what I try to say? You Hello. You're saying you put the plates over the water instead of outside the box, uh, so you don't have the plastic yeah, yeah. in between. Yeah, example. Yeah, I think it would be clear, uh, the better field. And if you just in case don't have nano coated, it also could be the way. What yeah. is your your sure. thoughts on it? Oh, well, I think you should try it and see and report back to us. Uh, it's, color doesn't change, so <laughs> you can't really <laughs> see it changing. Only when you put in uh, in the reactors and uh, see the effect only then. But uh, if you can get 
the taste of watermelon, the metal should uh, have the same effect, basically, logically. <laughs> Okay, we can think about that. I need to take a break. I've been at this for way too long and I'm falling asleep, so uh, okay, I have yeah, to sorry, take Gee just... home here. Well, we can bring that up later this afternoon. Or, uh, later, yeah, yeah, uh, thank you. Thank you, guys. And thank you for everything. You do a great job. All right. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, there is some questions on uh, on the YouTube just asking for more information. And there's lots of knowledge seekers out there that can help these people get up to speed a lot quicker than looking at 68 uh, or 67 other workshops uh, that are approximately four hours each. So um, I, I think we can all help each other to be able to get to the, uh, the position we want ourselves to be in by tonight, which is um, basically fossil fuel free. <laughs> so let's, uh, let's all help out our fellow neighbors and anybody that's willing to listen and, and uh, wants to make one of these devices. Um, if they're just starting out, let's all pitch together and help these people. Uh, there are lots, lots of um, uh, places like on Facebook that uh, have lots of different uh, opinions and uh, information about how to make the GANs. Um, and especially this, uh, the beginnings of this workshop uh, right at the beginning, uh, Alex did a good job in describing what needs to have happened to make uh, the GANs and the different styles uh, that he's using there. Um, so again, let's all help each other out and uh, there's lots of, lots and lots of resources that we can help each other out with. So point people in the right direction, point people to, to the, the good timings in the videos that might help them the most. And we can work toward a fossil free Friday. Exactly. <laughs> That's good. Okay. Um, anything else or shall we wrap it up for now? Uh, let's, let's wrap it up for now. Um, I, again, if there's uh, something that's going to be happening uh, really soon, then we will uh, schedule another live event. Uh, so please watch for that and we'll make sure that uh, information gets posted on Facebook and elsewhere. Yeah, I'm sure we'll be broadcasting through through the day here or night, whichever it turns out to be where you are. Okay. Okay. Thank you, everybody, for coming. Maybe Thank you should you. wrap it up like normal, Rick, and then we'll stop it uh, as there. Okay. That's, Thank you to both of you. That's the end of the, well, this part at least of the 68th Knowledge Seekers Workshop for July 2nd, 2015. And thank you everybody for attending. I stopped recording, but it didn't. Okay. What? The water boiler. That's what we did in the other lab. Yes, yeah, bring it. it. This is the other lab. Bring it. Actually, even if you put it on in the other lab, it still yeah, comes on it. Same thing. All the grids. Ah, okay. depends. Yeah. Okay, you can join us here. Bring the kettle. Well, anybody would like a cup of tea? <laughs> Very easily. Oh, he wants three of them. You took a picture close up. So what we see now is actually uh, they're trying to focus on. Yes, you see the one. Okay. Can you do the same with the top one? Okay, leave that there. Now, can you do the one with the top? Okay, fling, twist it till we see it. Huh? Yeah, it's Sopra. It is Sopra. No, a bit more? No, we have a light on it. Hey, there it is. Don't move. Don't move. You see the two is coming down. 
keep it there. Yeah, you see the two is coming down. It was zero and one. That's perfect. Yeah, it's the light you need to it. So now if you go back up, please, can you go up? You see the two is coming down very rapidly. This was zero. So by the end of the day, it says kilowatt hours. We are putting in 0 0.2 kilowatt hours into the Italian national grid. It's not illegal because we are not consuming any fuel. The international law says if you are producing energy from national resources or you bring sources in, it's a criminal offense. You need a license. We are not doing anything. We are using the national energy of our own heat of the body. All of us, the reactor which is running with the gas from the CO2. And the most beautiful thing with this is that if by tomorrow we go to two to three kilowatts an hour, we put 30, 50, 40 kilowatts a day into the grid. Not only we are not using, we are supplementing the government's subsidies. And on top of it, if a thousand or ten thousand Italians do the same, the mathematics build up very quickly. The mathematics is very simple. Ten thousand Italians put in fifty watt kilowatt a day. If one million Italians out of 70 million do it. That's 350 or 0.35 gigawatt of energy. But don't forget, this 1 million, not only they are putting in whatever they use, is not there either. So, in fact, is much two, three times bigger. So, a country like Italy, if the national government decides to support, will be energy free. And I'll tell you something Saudi Arabia King is planning a very big coup d'etat. One of the things I said I enjoyed. <laughs> in my trip seven years ago to Iran was the dress I had from the Office of Ahmadinejad was that you're not here for energy. We know energy resources is going to finish. Just contemplate on the space technology. And now we see what has happened. From today, there is no need for a single cent. It takes about two to three months to bring into national grid to be spent on fuel, which causes what has been the CO2 global warming. If this procedure followed, not only we absorb the CO2, but at the same time, we make for the first time the possibility to produce energy without damaging environment. There is no environmental damage. There is no reason for changing the environment except putting what we need. Something, it was zero and one, we've done a picture with a camera with what do you call it, mobile phones. And now you see the number two in red is coming up. So we have already started uh, supplying the grid with uh, two kilowatts of the energy from zero to one. Now we are going to two. So this proves completely the correctness of the structure. Thank you very much, Alex. So at this moment, we are supplying into the building the energy which they need. Why we see such a huge rapid um, drain is because the building is using energy. And in time, you will see this will go into one kilowatt, one, two kilowatt, blah, blah, and the rest of it. So in past hour, we have fed to the grid point nearly two kilowatts of energy. 
And as the ambient builds up, we will see we start supplying kilowatts. So already within two hours, the concept <coughs> is proven to be correct. And it's not just me, it's two, four, six, eight, ten of us here. We have watched it. We can confirm it was zero to one. And now it's one to two. So it's building up. Hopefully by four or five o'clock we see. And it's proven the correctness. We become a supplier to the Italian grid. So less than cost of one dollar. And if a thousand Italians do this, we'll become fantastic. This is what I explained to you. We have got this circuit set up by the Italian electricians. They've uh, done it yesterday. It was done especially for us to see. We have put out on the top and in on the bottom. This is the in and this is the out, you see it. And now the figure is running to, and um, we see where we're gonna get. Is there anywhere we can come close, the cameraman? Can you come close to see? No? Not in the zoom, it's enough. You cannot you zoom. zoom? You can zoom it enough. You cannot, uh, yeah, but that digit is, uh, it's, low. it's red. We have, anyway, you gotta trust our word, it's 10 of us, we don't lie. Shall we lie out together? It is a thousand. <laughs> I can actually, I was going to say, I can actually see that it's it's between the one and the two. Is that correct? The red number on the out? Yeah. This is what we said. You become national supplier, but don't forget, we are putting energy out in AC, in the national grid, where we are consuming two electric fans. Uh, the uh, input is still stays at one. So we are not taking anything from the grid. We are not taking any energy from the uh, system in this country. We become a supplier. I would like to send my bill to the electricity board. What, Mr. Kesh? Yes. Actually, all the components in the, um, in, in the, um, Pardon? the, all the, components in the classroom, they yeah. are taking <clears throat> energies from the the grid, um, the grid as well. So, ah. <coughs> so the, 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 which means it's supplying free, the, the, um, they're getting free energy from, from so um, the system. All our computers working here is taking energy from the system. That's what Alex tells us. Yeah, that's, that's correct. Yeah. And so what I want to check something is uh, the power of each fan. It is a 45 watt fan. So every, every, what do you call it? That's 90 watts an hour. In 10 hours, we use one kilowatt. So uh, we are not there yet. The famous Canadian word, are we there yet? We are not there yet. And the strange thing is we still add one. Armand, can you take a picture of this? Then you can do it because the cameraman can. Yeah. Uh, yes, would you like to connect yourself into it? No, you can connect yourself to it if you want to, Marco. Pardon? What has a different strength, which is Gans part of his structure to produce energy balance difference in plasma? Where? It's because he's used to wearing the microphone, so we just walked up to the board. <laughs> oh, it's true. Okay. I forgot it left behind me. Um, if you look at the cross section of this, you have the GANs, the nano layer, you have a 
tissue paper with a GANS, then you have brought a matter state with a GANS, and then what you've done, you've taken the energy, can I have a red bone please? You have taken energy with another nano layer on top. When you look at this cross section, this is what you have. Nano, a GANS embedded in tissue, then you introduce the aluminium, then on top of the aluminium, you introduce zinc. So, what you've done, all these are matter of different strength, because now the field force comes internally outwards. Because the GANS is more powerful than matter state. So, what you're getting is the push of a nano into the GANS out for the matter level to be absorbed. So, in this aluminum and in this zinc layer, you are reducing the energy of the plasma to matter state. So, what you are actually picking up here is a fraction of the fraction of the fraction. So, it means there is a, still a need for further understanding that in your development, Alex, to replace these two with a nano layer that instead of getting one kilowatt, you get 1,000 kilowatt. Because here, you're still working in a, a schizophrenia. No, you have a new, it's not a schizo. You have used different structure of the plasma. Very strong, holding to, pushing. This is exactly, if you look, is the same structure as what Armand did with a coil inside. Yeah? You understand? So, you have managed to break internally outwards. What I can tell you very interesting is, if the cameraman can show us, we go to the system, we have set it up here. If you look, we have put two fans as the load, and we have put the system here. Uh, I try to go away that you can see. We have put a system this way that two fans are taking energy. We have connected the energy, what is getting consumed to this meter, and what we are putting back into the grid here. This meter was a red number one when we started it which means we are not taking anything from the grid at all. This one, which is feeding to the grid, originally, two hours ago, was between zero and one kilowatt. And now is switching to one to two kilowatt. If you can come, the cameraman cannot come so close. You will understand very, very important is that because of the transformation in the system, this is the system running, this is your body, you will receive energies as you need. So you'll find out the members of people who live near these systems become very healthy because any deficiencies is supported but you cannot take more than what you need. So, what you should see in the coming time, reduction even in the health problems. 
this is a huge development. And we appetite, you lost, not lost your appetite, but you don't feel like eating because you have so much energy in you. you don't yeah. have need for food. Now you hear from Alex. He lives in the house with this system for eight weeks now. He says you don't lose your appetite, but you don't see a need for energy to eat because you receive what you need. This is what we said in the space. There it comes. The guru comes in with a teapot. Do, 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 do. He wants to increase as much as possible the energy consumption to see if the meter runs faster. We don't know if the fuse in this room, the few, the what they call the plugs, are connected to same phase as your power supply. So we see. Be careful. We don't want a boiling reactor. There it is. His, how many times are you going to boil it, Marco? Uh, oh, you're going to keep on pushing it? Oh, you can boil the whole container. You can boil the whole container. Be careful. Don't burn the university down, please. Huh? With, without it, we can't show anything. Huh? You're happy? No, oh, why not? Do we have a two kilowatt heater somewhere? Just plug it in. If you plug in a two kilowatt heater, we're doing it the wrong way. You have to plug that to the outside, not to here. We want to see if we can get consumption from this. You are taking from us free. Okay, let's boil it. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this, yeah. But this shows the energy taken from here. This is the incoming energy. We are not taking any energy coming in. So we're going to let you boil water. Leave it, leave it. Let the boil your water boil. And then we take it to a circuit outside. That uh, the energy... No, 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 no. We want to see if you are taking anything from the grid. And we want to see if you are putting anything into the grid. This is the outgoing. This is how it's set up by the electrician. Yeah? So the, this one, the more you are using, the faster we are going. So it means as we increase demand internally, we increase our export. You see, now it's literally two. Can you come close? Uh, um, excuse me, Giovanni. We are actually supplying. We are supplying into the grid. Giovanni, your light here, yeah, enlighten us. We are actually gone to two now. There he comes, the happy man. The Italian car. There we are, you can yes, see I mean it. If you can show it there, <laughs> He's <living away. laughs> you see the two is clearly now two. It was one a few minutes ago. Yeah, perfect. And if you go to input. The, you... um, the light for the one watt an hour is actually blinking a lot faster as well. Pardon? The light, let me unmute on this one too. Uh, well, the, no, no. the light. The light is actually blinking faster too. Here we have a three phase. Depends on which phase the light sits. If you turn the light off, maybe we can see it. The other one, the other one. No, it's no different. It's worse. It's worse. Ju, 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 ju. Yeah. Should be good. Yep. Okay. Uh, first of all, uh, I should thank Alex for coming all the way to show his understanding and development of the technology. As usual, we see our technology so correct that we are not afraid to share knowledge and we are not afraid other people around the world to copy, to develop new concepts and do things. 
we warn when it's wrong. I warn strongly when the things are wrong and it's getting done. And when the people do it because they think they can do it, foundation stays totally apart and independent from any damage to the foundation. I explained this very thoroughly. Yesterday, in the recording, what came, we asked when we announced that when you mix ganses with amino acid, it can create new germ, new viruses because of the combination of fields. And I warn you categorically, anyone who uses or contemplates to use, to develop, to manufacture needles as part of the structure of acupuncture, you are playing with people's life. And Keshe Foundation stays totally independent from this one. We told the technology, if anyone develops it categorically, because I can explain how you create diseases in people, you don't understand. And people look for their own private, what do you call it, profit pocket. You are responsible for people's life. Especially if you're in the medical field and you do it with the warning I give. So if any new diseases or death cause, the stands responsible by you and not by the foundation. We are very categorical about this because we know there are people around the foundation who are developing or trying in China, especially Dr. Elia Kostova, to develop needles in acupuncture. I warn her, she has nothing to do with the foundation. She's categorically beyond the limits. We have warned that uh, if such a step has taken, I hope I'm wrong, but uh, uh, it's for people to understand and authorities to understand, we separate these kind of actions from the cash foundation. These kind of needles, nano-coated in any shape or form, delivers energies on the layer which body has no immunity for, a skin cancer, and different kind of cancers are inevitable. We warn and anything to intrude. And I give this categorical oh, warning to Dr. Dr. Kassova is beyond the limitation of the medicine while you are warned to practice and develop such a technology. And it has nothing to do with the work of the Keshe Foundation. And this can create huge damages to people who use it long term and short term. Time will tell and we stay independent from this. The same as what we warn about the use of amino acid in uh, reactors. I think I'm quite clear. Yeah? We made our point uh, very clear in this respect. Uh, so amino acids can attain and produce new microbes and diseases. So it's your responsibility not to do. It's your certainty to be aware how you do and how you develop these kind of uh, materials. Uh, today, we have touched on the structure of change. The structure of a new beginning with the help of Alex and understanding of the technology in different way. What we learned today is bringing the whole totality of the energy, matter, composite ganses together. And uh, what we've seen in how to use the nano layers as a different strength in conjunction with the GANs as different strength, in conjunction with the matter.